<clears throat> You're too close. It's gonna hurt. It's supposed to hurt. And why are you smiling? I'm... what? Oh, God, if Cam comes out here with boobs, I'm leaving. Dad? I hope he didn't embarrass you, Mom. Oh, don't mind her. Haley had her first boy over today, and Phil shot him. Anyway, um... So, you know, if Haley got pregnant, would you ever pretend she has mono for a few months and then, like, tell everyone the baby's yours? No, stop, stop. No, you come into my house and you insult me and my boyfriend, who, by the way, is not that dramatic. And, oh, God. I get up at six. <laughs> I get up at five. Seriously, I get up at six. That's you? I, th I thought we had a raccoon. Are you still baby-proofing? Everything we own is pointy. Why is our daughter dressed like Donna Summer? She's not Donna Summer. Clearly, she's Diana Ross from the RCA years. Huh? See? Fun, right? <laughs> oh, my. Was that her head? No, I think if it was her head, she would be. <laughs> yeah, it was her head. Okay. Yeah. But it's a dog. Yeah, I know. That's why it's funny. I don't think it's as funny as you think it is. Can we please just call your sister? No, no. Cam, Cam, why? So she can be all judgmental and condescending, like she's the expert and I don't know how to take care of a baby? Mitchell, she is your family. Of course she's going to be judgmental and condescending. You, you, you baby-proof the entire house. You took care of all the adoption paperwork. Without you, we wouldn't even have a baby to injure. We each have our own strengths. Now, who are amazing parents? We are. I can't hear you. We are. Don't you forget it. Okay. Did we just lock our baby in the car? Did you put the keys in the bag? I put the keys in the bag. That's oh, Mitchell, I told you not to put the keys Don't in the bag. Out. I've never been more proud of you. I'm sure your friends are going to love it. Break the flute. What? The poncho by itself is fine. The poncho, plus the flute, plus the stupid dance, my son will die a virgin. Lily, it's OK. Maybe What are you singing to her? People get arrested for this, Mitchell. H I J K L M N. Do all four doors lock? So what does it matter, Claire? What? You seem sad. It's just stuff with Alex, you know, kid stuff. Ugh, kids. You don't have to tell me. My school is full of them. You drove a plane into my face. You must have moved. I told you to stay still. I didn't move. Try not to talk. I want to make sure nothing's broken. Mitchell, I found the diapers. They're over here. Cameron, guess what I found? Coffins. They sell baby formula and they sell coffins. You can literally buy everything you need from birth to death. Oh my god. So, you ever kiss another girl? That's no way to talk to your grandmother. Emergency assistance, this is Trina. Right, well, we, lo we locked our baby in the car and people are judging us. I swear to God, I'm gonna break it! Do not break the window, you'll get glass on her. Sir, please tell your wife to relax. Everything is going to be okay. That's a man. Really? Don't worry, Lily! It... Lily, daddy's coming for you! Sir, we just sent the signal. The door should be unlocked check, now. Check the door. Check the door, check the door. It's not unlocked! Oh! Oh! Okay. That is amazing. How did they do that? I don't know, it's just, we got it, thank Did you. come from space? My culture meant a great pride in doing physical labor. I know, that's why I hire people from your culture. <laughs> You're too funny. I'm gonna share that one with my next husband when we're spending all your money. S T U P W X Y and C. Whoa, Lily, oh, not so high. Oh. So that is a big moment for her. Yeah. Would you like a videotape? Mommy. Uh, you know, I, I don't I don't know if I can actually get her to do it again, so. Uh, well, we tape all of our classes. We don't like parents bringing cameras in. Thank it keeps you. them out of the moment. If you don't want to wear a dress to the wedding, it's not the end of the world. It's all right. I bought one. <laughs> <laughs> do you see how she has to provoke me? Talk about it next week. No one knows this, but for the first year of his life, I made up money like a girl and told everybody that he was my daughter. <laughs> I bet just for a few times. I didn't want to mess with his head. When he found the pictures, I told him that it was his twin sister who died. Why aren't they trying to hurt each other? I was the first one to fall asleep.
What's on your face? A smile from having such a good time with my friends. Mom, instead of dredging up the whole incident, maybe we should just try and repress it like a, like a normal family. Cause baby, baby, I just want to do you, do you. Do you want to do me, do me underneath the moonlight, the moonlight. Is there something you want? Yes, there is. To connect with this girl right here. Now, come on, pretend I'm not your dad. We're just a couple of friends kicking it in a juice bar. What's a juice bar? OK, a malt shop, whatever. Dad, no, I don't. No, who's dad? Who's dad? I'm, I'm Marcus from biology. Hey, Haley, how's it going with you and Dylan? Has he tried anything inappropriate with you? What are you talking about? Well, I'm, I'm moving to a far and dangerous place. Yeah. Canada. Found its place, cause baby, baby, I just wanna do you, do you. Baby, you could do me, do me, man, I will do you, do you. Maybe it would heal you, heal you from the inside. From the inside. From the inside. From the inside. Come, you love scrapbooking. Did I, Mitchell? Did I? No, stop. Don't do the double question to prove a point thing. I hate it when people do that. Do you, Mitchell? Do you? Stop, Lily. Where are you? I'm showing a house. What house? I'm golfing. So, my interest in football ended as suddenly and dramatically as the climax of West Side Story. <laughs> I'm a musical theater fan. Surprise! Take them away, Phil. Gloria, we all know you'd be fine without underwear. I mean, we know it's not about that. I'm sorry. Okay, so take back your sword and go fight this girl like a bull. Okay. Can hear you. Okay! I can't hear you! That's really as loud as I can go. So the buyer's coming back in an hour with her husband, and I need him. I am telling you, that kid is a genius. There's the rainmaker. Why is your iPod in your mouth? I'm charging it. Let's get out of here. Get this thing in the trunk. I can't decide if I'm feeling more proud or mortified. How about now? Yeah, it'll just take a second. Well, I'm just, you're gonna miss me slotting it up with driving Miss Daisy. It'll just take a second. <sighs> you should kill that baby. Oh, come on, man. She's not your sister. Give her a proper snow. <laughs> <laughs> That's a bad joke, not funny. My sister lost her feet to complications from diabetes. Oh, okay. What do we do? Do, do we say something? How, how do we even bring it up? She threatened our child, and that's your concern. A, a segue? A spill? I'm just... Okay. Did she just fall asleep? God, I wish Lily would fall asleep like that. Give her eight shots of tequila. Mm. Fine. What would you suggest we get him, then? Get him a gift card. A gift card? Yeah. Who hurt you? No, mommy, don't go in, por favor! I must! I'm coming! Any ass kicking clown that'll twist you like a balloon animal. I will beat your head against this bumper until the airbags deploy. So apologize to my boyfriend right now! Apologize? Boyfriend? Apologize! Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let's go. We're gonna be late. Um, Scott, I, I I have a confession to make. Yeah. Um, I didn't uh, I didn't clean the lint tray, so um, your clothes might be a little pilly. You sound great. And Merry Christmas. Wow. Even your apology is off key. Not cool, buddy. <laughs> it's not torture. Cam. It's just hard if you happen to be a person who hates to hear another person suffer. <laughs> or two people suffer. Cam. I'm going to be fine. We know, Dad. We don't know that. It's a miracle I'm standing up. But look, in case anything happens...
Don't cry, Luke. I'm okay. I broke the coffee table. That's okay. What? I broke the glass coffee table. The one you swore you didn't break? And then we blamed Esperanza and fired her? And she stole a turkey at Thanksgiving for her family and got deported? Yeah. Damn it! I'm sorry. You will be sorry. Go, Jay. Yeah, go yes, Jay. go, Jay, and take money with you, too. OK. No, Manuel Alberto, in the car, or I put you in the trunk. The hardest part is when people forget their card, because then I look like the idiot. All right, let's do it again. We really have to go. You think I like this? I'm sorry. Here, oh, I'm my. Gonna, I'm going to teach you one, OK? On the count of three, just grab this. You ready? Put your hand okay. up. One, two, three. There it is. No. Camp? Does a gardener usually work on Saturdays? I don't know. He comes when we need him. He's like Batman, but straight. Is he crying? Oh, yeah. We should probably, probably go out the back, huh? He's clearly in pain. How can you just turn your back on a friend like that? A friend? Oh, really? Yeah. What's his name? Caesar Salazar. Let's go. Hi. Donde esta mi novio? Su camión está aparcado afuera. I think this has something to do with the gardener. You think? We are going. These folks can find their own way out. And now you'll know that I'm not a manic Mother Teresa out there collecting lost souls. Oh, come on. And without Mitchell, I would just keep giving and giving and giving. I'm like a big runaway charity truck, and Mitchell is my off-ramp full of safety gravel. He knows how to say no. He always can put himself first. He certainly can turn his back on someone suffering. Um, Oh, that was nice. Oh, come on, Dad. He doesn't like it. He knows where he can go. Enter a destination. Hell. Mexican food. Shut up. I came out of the closet in my mid-20s. I, I had to actually come out to my dad three times before he finally acknowledged it. I'm not sure if maybe he was hoping he heard it wrong, like I had said, Dad, I'm gray. Haley, stop it! What are you doing? Tearing out my heart! Okay. Oh, why don't you go get a hickey from Sherry Nicolini? It's from my guitar strap, Haley! Oh, my God. Oh, God. What? The flowers. They look so much better. This is a disaster. You do know what disaster means, right? You don't understand. I demanded that they come exchange them. I got all medieval on the florist. Oh. <laughs> Cam, I... I heard you on the phone. You, you said you were displeased, but that's hardly going medieval. Excuse me, I said very displeased, and I used my cowboy voice, so. What, what are you doing? I'm microwaving them so they look bad again. Manny, what kind of cupcake do you want? Um, that's OK. I'm not hungry. That was a mistake. Now she'll know something's up. Are you OK? I'm fine. She cut that guy off. She's a terrible driver. She's a danger to us all. Hey, Dad. Hi. Hi. I'm here to let you know your gaydar is broken. My dream for him is that one day he'll be on the Supreme Court. Why, Cam? So at parties, I can tell everyone my partner is one of the Supremes. Hey! Phil, what are you, what are you doing? Just concluding a little business. Very successfully, I might add. Honey. Uh... Hey! Hi! Ah, what the hell was that? Our butts pressed against each other. They didn't press, it was glancing. Stop talking about it. Oh, come on, all the time you've spent in the locker room, this can't be your first moon landing. Well, Haley and I got into another fight. Oh, say anything. Um, good morning. No, say anything. Newspaper. No, Dylan, say anything, clutch movie. Clutch movie. Happy Valentine's Day. Oh, happy Valentine's Day. Take this sweet gift as a token of my affection, my unending love and admiration. Oh my god, yay, it's big! <laughs> what do you think? I think you're not getting any sleep tonight. So you might want to take a nap at work today. I always do. Um, that's Manny. I said we would watch him tonight. I hope you don't mind. I didn't know you were going to be going through all this. No, it's fine. It might be nice to have him around. <laughs> that always makes me laugh. Hi, Manny. The universe is cold and loveless. Thinks that he can roll right over the little guy until the little guy says enough. And that's what this little guy's doing right here, right now. Can we stop calling me little guy? I'm in the 40th percentile. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. Day. Yeah. Oh, okay. Bye. See ya. Bye. 
Oh, that's <laughs> Shame! Well, it's just nice to see out of your lab coat. You actually have quite a nice figure. Take it down a notch. We're just trying to make a friend, not initiate a three-way. Well, her first word was every gay father's worst nightmare. Mommy! Oh. Start this from the beginning. Could you smile first? I'll be less nervous if you smile. I'm not man enough to fight this. Here, hold my purse. Honey, if they don't, then you do the exact same thing I told your sister, okay? Take three deep breaths and relax. Even the advice I get is a hand-me-down. Mom, I did it! I passed! Oh, oh my god! I got my license! I have my Woo! license! I got my license! Hey, car's on park. Oh, oops. You better run to that counter, run! And how are things with you and your mom now? Uh, the only way she'll be happy is if I'm some Asian stereotype, but that just isn't me. Junior Congress at noon? Doesn't she also have no boys at forever? Don't you have an eating disorder you need to attend to? So either come in tomorrow or don't bother coming back again. Need the ID to uh -huh. make the elevator go down to freedom. Those kids, I could take Luke home with me. No, <laughs> be my guest. Seriously, you go right here. <laughs> <laughs> no, I like it here. Uh. Okay, no, no, she's just calm, calm down. This is what we're gonna do. I am going to, I'm gonna do what I'm trying to do. I am going to lie, grovel, debase myself until I get what I want. I am a lawyer, damn it. The people here, Cameron. I'm pretty sure I had wheels when I parked here. I know what Luke's problem is. He's got ADHD. No. No, I don't. What is it? I'd tell you, but you'd wander off before I got to the H. Brown. Whatever. Honestly, I wish that tart would go back to Columbia and take her weird little brown friend with her. You find that blanket? No. This was all I could find. Shut up. What? You scared? You scared? Mitchell, what are you doing here at 4.17 on a Saturday afternoon? I beat you on our honeymoon. Or did I let you win? You didn't let me win. Why would I sacrifice my queen for your pawn, Jay? Huh? 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 Hey, uh, Dad, do you remember when I was uh, probably 11 and you were teaching me how to fight and then I quit? Yeah, when you said everything you needed to learn, you'd learn from West Side Story. How is spending a ton of money on greeting cards saving us a fortune? It's math. It's really not. Look it up. 295, 295, 495, 40% off, 40% off, 40% off. I don't know about you, but I'm not gonna stand here and feel sorry for myself. You know what we should do? Get pregnant. I was gonna say go for ice cream. Okay, we do yours first. I am loving our life. I am in a really dark space. Being away from my Lily is literally torture. And I can't pressure Mitchell, but I really, really, really just want him to get a job so I can go back to being a stay-at-home dad slash trophy wife. I'm used to taking charge, that's all. I should have let you coach from the get-go. And? I love you. No. And don't worry, you know, I'm not, not going to take any job. <laughs> you better not. I just was... I just... I just be as, you know... I just... I just... I just girl, she say what she Everybody, Mitchell Pritchett and his partner, Cameron. Hey. Uh, business partners, uh, mergers and acquisitions. <laughs> I'm kidding, we're gay. Stop talking. Stop touching something. Oh, that was it. All right. Mitchell! Oh, my no. God. Did, oh, my God! No, Cam. 
Cam, did we do, did we do that? Did, what, what are we gonna How say? We, oh. oh. I will take the job. I can jam. Well, you know, I totally would, but I'm not sure we like the same sorts of music, you know? Oh, what, because I'm gay, I'm just gonna wanna play show tunes? No, because you're old. I think he wants to go out. Good boy. Smart dog. I hate to break it to you, but I think all dogs can do that. I'm gonna play outside! <laughs> Oh, silly me. I had the sticks in the wrong hands. Hey, what's with the big sweater at a concert? Is that a gay thing? No, Dad, it's for my friend Pepper's Opry Ski Fondue. Yeah, yeah, it's a gay thing. Dude, you should label those sticks. Luke, stay. I love you. Come Luke, back stay. soon. I'll see you later. Luke, stay. Luke, stay. Thanks, Daryl. I know I got a lot of baggage, but don't worry. I'm seeing a therapist. Just kidding. I'm fine. Oh, <laughs> so this was your idea. Happy birthday, Jay. Uh, thanks, buddy. Yeah, uh, last year, I flew back from New York next to a baby who was very upset the entire flight, and it was hell. I was on that flight with you, and I don't recall. Oh, I get it. You're talking about me. It's very funny. Yeah, we couldn't get tickets to Billy Elliot. All he wanted to do was dance. And that's my story. Yeah, five hours of this. I just want to dance with the ballet! Yeah. Hey, you little monkey! No standing around! There you go! Here goes Owen! There you go! There, here comes Owen! There you go! Why did you dress her in Jungle Prince? Because I thought it would be cute. She's gonna think she's back in Vietnam. Billy! You like being a basketball player? Serious? I choked. I didn't think you'd look up here at me. Come on, let's go. Get your hands off of me. No, no, make me. Make me, yes. make me. Uh, oh, oh, my God. oh, how weird is this? Quick, quick, tell me something to say that'll freak him out. Tell him I'm pregnant. No, I'm not gonna say that. Well, here we go. How funny is this? <laughs> Hey, it's Phil. You know what to do. Gloria tells me you had a real good time. Not really. No, I didn't. God, I love your daughter. Oh, I... Well, the spray tan starlet claims to be six weeks sober, Sources down under say she has been bar hopping like a coked up kangaroo. I'm just letting you know now, I'm not taking care of him when you guys die. Stop. Every home improvement project that we've undertaken has been a near death experience. Make the appetizers. <laughs> if an accident does happen, I hope he kills me. Because I don't think I would be a very inspiring disabled person. Oh, where are you going? I'm going on a walk. And, uh, oh, yeah, I can still do that by myself. Watch. Oh, I hope I don't get hurt. Oh, God, who put that door jam there? I didn't see it. I ran right into it. Mitchell just wants to feel like he's part of the man club. Isn't that where you guys met? I know you're making a joke because you're uncomfortable, so I'll let it slide, and we met in an orgy. What the hell, Mitchell did that? Yes, yes, Mitchell did it. Who's the bitch now, bitches? <laughs> Mitchell has a problem with public displays of affection. Um, I remember once at a New Year's Eve party, stroke of midnight, he high-fived me. Two problems with that. One, gays don't high-five. Two, gays don't high-five. Phil's not better than me at anything. Except maybe making that stupid sound with his mouth. A what, what? Nobody kisses at a bowling alley. I almost got a turkey. Yellow. Oh, hey, Jay, just a sec. I'll go get Claire. Oh, actually, it's you I'm calling. <laughs> what was that? The cat. There's a cat. What's up? The computer and the printer must talk, talk, talk. Command P makes the picture walk, walk, walk. How come it's not working? It should be. 
Okay. Uh, that should be printing. So, hey, Phil, I'm going to get a beer, beer, beer before I hit you in the head, head, head. Now there. My mom said her dead grandmother was in the house. She said she felt her here this morning, in this room. Maybe your mom's mentally ill. I'm not stepping into that one. We're not playing good cop mom. Pepper has done the impossible. He's made two gay men hate brunch. That thing almost fell on me. I was sitting there and it came this close to my head. It's all right, you're okay. You didn't get hurt. Well, I'm not gonna wait around here until I do. Oh! We're okay. I'm Phil and Claire. Uh, I'm on the other line with them right now, one second. Hello? Oh, shoot, we lost Phil. We lost Phil? We lost Phil? Hello? Great, now Gloria's gone. Gloria's gone too? I fell all the way to the couch. Mm -mm. It almost killed me. No, it didn't. This cabinet barely moved. That's just perspective playing tricks on your mind. Like if I hold up my thumb, it looks bigger than your head. No, it doesn't. It looks tiny. We have to look at it from over here. How can I look at my head from over there? Go. Oh, thank God, thank God, thank God, Phil. <sighs> Phil? He was running around here, turning off the gas line, cleaning up broken glass, and taking care of Luke after he ran into a wall. I got scared because the cabinet didn't fall down. Mm -hmm. Hey, I think I'm going to take this spin class tomorrow morning. Oh, sure. Oh, I get it. Message received. I didn't say anything. Probably just show yourself out. I hear I hear some crying down the hallway. Look at that. That's a good dad. Because you've got a baby and you hear every little sound. I would have I wouldn't have even noticed. Crying. <laughs> hey. Who's this? Brilliant. No, I didn't see it. I get a lot of texts. She's gonna fall behind. Don't you think I know that? <sighs> this is perfect. Oh, leave it to the gays to raise the only underachieving Asian in America. You know what's ironic? You come over here complaining, yet I have never once said a word about that obnoxious parrot of yours that's always squawking. Parrot? What parrot? Yay! 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 My hairdresser's brother has three kids. They live in the country. They were so happy to have the dog, and they gave me a jar of pickles. Buy her a Blackberry. That's all she's gonna want to do anyway. What does she say? She says to buy her a Blackberry. Lily doesn't have the dexterity for that, Claire. What is happening? Why didn't you just tell me this in the first place? I like you would be okay with me stealing a dog. No. Exactly, that's why I didn't tell you. Now the dog is happy, Manny can sleep, and we have pickles. Okay. Hey! Oh, we hated Billingsley. The place is so oh. stupid. You blew the interview, didn't you? Lesbians. In a wheelchair. Oh. Very funny, Mom. I know it's Halloween. Nice fake hand. <laughs> Listen, did you ever do anything about costumes for Claire's thing tonight? I'm going to pick them up this afternoon. You're going to be a gargle, and I'm going to be an evil village brook. I know less now than I did before I asked. What do you see what we got planned for tonight? Claire and I are going as corpse bride and groom. As if there's any other kind, am I right? <laughs> I'm saying that marriage kills you. Judy left me. Oh my god, I am so sorry. I know that I have an accent, but people understand me just fine. What the hell is this? I told you, Jay. I called your secretary and told her to order you a box of baby cheeses. Oh, no. Right back here. Claire, I don't know that I'm I'm feeling up to this. Why, Cam? Why? What happened that is so awful you simultaneously can't speak of it and yet can't stop talking about it? I can't. It's too emotional. Okay. Some other time. I was ten. Oh, God. But beware of the fog, for you might not be able to see ahead. <gasps> Boo. Timmy started running. 
I wanted to run too, but my hunch got stuck on a rose bush, and that's when I fell. I fell hard. I can see his feet. I barely remember it. I remember crashing through the wall and the ambulance ride to the hospital. That wasn't an ambulance. I drove you. Then what was that siren? It was your mother. How did you get on the set? I walked on. It's not MGM. It's a warehouse behind a mattress store. Uh, Claire never mentioned she had a husband. Nice to meet you. You too. Oh, sorry. I burnt my lady fingers. Hey, Dad. I think I found a place online where I can sell this organ. Can you drive me to the black market? I've always loved her. He says he's so sorry and that he's always loved you. Please come up and talk to me. Please come up and talk to him. His life would be empty without you. I'm sorry I'm going off script. It just felt right. You want to make this interesting? Yeah, I don't think that's possible. We take two cars and see who gets there first. Fine, fine. Let's do that. It's on. Yeah, it is on. I'll take the girls. Luke, your dad and I are splitting up. Why? Another one of their stupid arguments. OK. We'll go with that. No, no, buddy, come with me. I'm trying to teach you to be organized. Your mind is scattered, Gloria. Your mind is going to be scattered. Manny, hand me the gun. Helen. Donald. Cam. <gasps> Hang on. Hang on, Helen. I'll have you down in a jiffy. Hold on tight. Ow. Nails. Help. On the box it says ages 16 and up. Is this an appropriate gift for me? Are you kidding me? You were born 16. You know, we wouldn't be having this problem if you hadn't lost the spare set. I didn't lose them. Somebody came in here and stole them and left the car. We should go, this is kind of weird. No, this is joyful, Mitchell. You, of all people, should... So dumb guys go for dumb girls and smart guys go for dumb girls? What do the smart girls get? Cats, mostly. It's nice that you care so much about us. Without love, we're nothing. But what about his wife? It was a pleasure meeting you both. I mean, everywhere I look, I see her face. Uh. To be fair, Dylan, that is a family portrait. I gotta go get some of my stuff. Is that cool? Oh, sure. Yeah. Uh. There she is again. Uh. 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 Oh, don't look on the bookshelf. You're just gonna... Uh. Okay, I am not gonna cry, but I want to know why, Mitchell, why you are presenting to my mother like a baboon. I wanted you to see her fondling me. You know, I was a lot like you in high school. Except my hair was shorter and my guitar was a flute. Oasis for men? That's funny. <laughs> you made that sound like a question, then you didn't wait for me to answer. What? Here, let me show you. What? Yeah, 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 you go. You go, uh, Oasis for men? You see what I mean? You went, Oasis for men? You should have said Oasis for men? And I go, yeah, give me two. But instead, you went, Oasis for men. Okay, I get it. You see it. what I mean? I, I get it, no, I'm I get sure it. No, you do. You sprayed before men. You went, Oasis for men. Okay, men. okay, okay, men. stop it. Men, stop it. Because people aren't food, people aren't food. Your friends will run away if they're scared of being chewed. And as a side note, private parts are private. Men, stop men. it. Men, stop men. it. Men, men, men. Men, 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 men. I am getting the pepper. Uh, no, no, you are not. Cam, you're not doing her any favors by being soft. Oh, well, then why don't you just skip the pepper? I'll get some pliers and we'll pull her teeth now. Please relax. It's a seasoning. Okay, well, then why don't you try some? Pop it. No, try a little. Pop it. No, try Stop a little Cam, bit. Stop it. Don't you get Stop. No, I'm sorry. Put no. some in there. Ow, you bit me. Anyway, he's a super cool guy and he's straight, so there's no weirdness. Aside from you turning into a 16-year-old girl. I did not. <laughs> Cameron, give me your arm. Okay. Okay, fine. Keep judging. Don't let anyone in. I could care less. I think you mean you couldn't care less, because if you could care less, that means that you care a little bit. Oh, my husband. I'm coming! You two so lucky they don't let you get married. Barry? Yep. <sighs> I'm falling, I'm Look falling. straight ahead. Go, go, go. No, Pedal. Jay! What are you ringing a bell for? I, why you let me go? No, Jay! no, pedal. No, look I... where you're going. Look where you're going. What's up? Are you living in our daughter's princess castle? What? No, don't be ridiculous. I'm living in here, man. I'm sleeping in there. You said you had just moved in upstairs. No, I said I just moved in. I'm, I'm sorry, I thought it was implied. That, that... you're living in a dollhouse? Mitchell and I like you very much. Thank you. But I'm, you're welcome. 
I'm going to take your hand. Yes, I am. Don't give me the coyote look. I'm not a canine. We're going to walk out of here together. Mm. Nobody's going to hurt you. It's not going to end very well. But no. Give me your hand. But you know, we, should, we, should all, we should all hang out. Yeah. Uh, no. We'll take care. Okay. Hmm. Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah, well, you don't just tell your partner you may have a baby with someone else and expect them to go back to eating a delicious and inventive meal like it's nothing. Okay, mm -hmm. Karen, but e even if he is mine, it, it doesn't change anything between us. Mitchell, I need to have my reaction. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. After you, doctor. After you, professor. <laughs> Our kids walked in on us. We were... As they say, oh. having sex. That's not a euphemism, Phil. That's exactly what we were doing. Having sex. In front of our children. Well, they weren't there when we started. No. In fact, you weren't even there when we started. They can take us at 515. What are we, 80? Or 1045. What are we, 20? Because that is the only way I'm going to hold it together when my babies are looking at me with judgment and disgust. First of all, that's how they always look at us. Oh, Phil. Secondly, this isn't as traumatic as you think. Honey, I walked in with my parents having sex once. It was, oh, awful. I can't even get the image out of my mind. Claire, we're not your parents. We're in much better shape. She won't make us pay. I mean, we wouldn't make someone pay if this happened to us. Did you not hear her on the phone? Fix it. Replace it. Write me a check. She probably has that embroidered on a pillow. Or next to a jar of human tears. Oh, uh, can we have some napkins, please? All out of napkins. Paper towels and bathroom, Mitchell. He knows your name. Make up some lie. Ditch that wife of yours and meet me at our hotel in 30 minutes. You think you can manage that? Baby doll, I've been lying to my wife for 16 years. Okay. You had a whole year to plan, but you don't make an effort. I am the second wife, Jay. Why do you treat me like I'm the first? Claire, I'm leaving. Deal with it. You just said he didn't. Well, I was protecting your feelings. He hugged me in the elevator. Well, pick out China and move to Vermont. He said it kills him to see someone else have something he wants. Yes, yes, you're the someone, and I'm the something. Mm. Appletini? I win! What do you mean you win? I know you think I think you're not romantic, but I think you think I'm not smarter than you. So now we know you are romantic, and I'm smarter than you, and I bought you a motorcycle. I am just a bored housewife with a dark side and an hour to kill. Is that what I think it is? It's not a gift card. Wow. That feels really good. Because you're free. And really scary. I haven't been single since I was nine. Cam, Monica can't come to Lily's birthday party this weekend. Her mom's gonna be in Chicago. Oh, that's fantastic. What part is she playing? The city of Chicago. Oh. Okay, gun to your head. Okay. Which pair should I wear? Oh, gun to my head. I'd say pull the trigger. Hi, you've reached Jay. And Gloria, please leave a message after the beep. What was that? You told me to make the beep. No, I didn't tell you to make the beep. I told you to say the word beep. If I say the word, then people think it's the beep. It's not the beep. Then why even say it? You read my diary. Well, yeah, I, I read it because uh -huh. I wanted to see if you were on drugs. It's called parenting, Claire. Okay. Every I'm... time he opens his mouth, I can feel my daughter's losing respect for me. You know, I never liked that guy. He used to always put me in a headlock. It is amazing the freaks we used to date. Hello, Governor! I gotta jump. Do you want me to hold it and stand in the driveway? Oh, come on. It's going to be a boring party without any entertainment. I agree, which is why I hired a princess. Cue the <gasps> gas. How could you do that? How dare you? Entertaining and delighting children is who I am. Be a parent. But I want to... No. I want to... Now. Say, stop. Princesses don't get paid, except maybe in laughter and sparkles. <laughs> That's nice, but I really need to know. All I ask is that a little girl's birthday wishes come true. Miss, seriously, if you want to get paid, I need Fine, to... Fine, you can make the check out to Party Stars Incorporated. Never break character. Never, ever. 
but... But nothing. When I was a clown, my shoe caught on fire, and one of my fellow clowns put me out with a bucket of flammable confetti. What's happening? Even as they loaded me into the ambulance, I continued to make balloon animals... Oh, whoa, 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 not now, not now, not now, not now, not now, no, stop, please. She accused me of trying to steal my old boyfriend from her. Okay, fine, but make it quick. Oh, God, no. Oh, God, yes! Oh, oh, God, yes! Oh, get after it! Oh, amazing. You are, you don't know! We've had this conversation a hundred times. You know, no, no, I'm not, I'm not doing this again. You tell me what you did. Uh... Uh... Was, was it? Was it? No, Phil. No, 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 no! Claire. I'm going to get some air. Claire! No, don't follow me! Happy Valenberth anniversary! Hey! Uncle Cam for Uncle Mitchell. How could you, Mitchell? Honestly! You want to hear the guest list for tonight? So far, it's anger, betrayal, terror, and sadness. Congratulations, Mitchell. You packed the house. Were you all done here? Uh, actually, no. Um, I will have more iced tea, another iced tea, and a uh, mango kiwi smoothie, all ice cream. I'm pregnant. You know, he's not really your arch enemy. That's sort of a made up thing. Fix it! Sometimes it takes a lot of work. Arps. The summer's gone and all the roses. You keep this up, and this won't be the last plug I pull. Hey, what's going on here? I'm taking the negative charge out of the word adopted, yay. What did Oprah do now? Here we go. Let's see. Oh, okay. Is it bad? No, it's gonna be fine. You're gonna be okay. Oh, honey. Hey, I forgot my phone. Hi. What? And I love you. Ta-da! What is ta-da? I'm just saying, this is it. Ta-da. Ta-da is when you do a flip or where the magician cuts the pretty lady in half. Not when you show someone where you want to shove their dead body. I'm not going to argue the proper use of ta-da. This is it. Seriously. In the file cabinet. This is a legal document. She only has your last name. My name's just a middle name. Stay calm. Don't get upset. Nobody knows anyone's middle name. Quick, what's my middle name? Scott. Of course you know mine. We're a couple. Hi, oh, look at this. An empty coffee can. Do you know what men used to buy me? When I go... Toss me in the fire, sweep up my ashes, stick them in that. Ta-da! We need to talk about this. Ta-da! Dunphy Spring Classic. Who's going to do the dishes for the next week? Boys versus girls. Testosterone versus estrogen. Standing up to pee versus the oh, squad. come on! I've been spending a lot of time with a lot of straight people lately, and darling, I need a night with my homies. You mean homos. <laughs> Yeah. What are you two arguing about? Never mind, I don't want to know. For so all you need to do is put her down in about a half hour and not let a serial killer in the front door. Well, what if he's cute? Well, then save him for us. <laughs> <laughs> I was drunk. I'm not going shopping with Priscilla, queen of the desert. Okay, Dad. Well, I'm feeling really good about our relationship, and I want to hold on to that for a little while longer, so I'm going to go ahead and hang up with you. Give Pepper a big kiss for me. Do we really have to look at them now? Don't worry, we're not expecting any miracles. <sighs> Thank you. Oh, that's Haley's score? So you sure? Are they bad? No, they're not bad. Are they good? No, they're average. <gasps> Sweetie, we did it. Our baby is average. Medium five. Oh. I knew this would happen. Why do you have to throw a wet blanket on my dreams? I do not. You do it all the time. And you know what I end up with? Wet dreams. I heard it as soon as I said it. Just leave it alone. You gotta talk to Cam. He's driving us crazy. Kevin is biting his nails again, and Reuben hasn't had a bowel movement in a week. Don't laugh, that's how Elvis died. Hi, you stupid you two! Ah, don't hit him, he has cancer. What? We love the word. Where's the owl? It's Luke. Lower the insignia. Lower. Oh. Luke, do you mind? We're trying to have a moment here. I can't feel my heart beating in my eyes. Hey, Mom, check it out. What are you doing? If I move my head fast enough, it looks like the can is standing still. But you get so defensive whenever we talk about Luke's issues. He doesn't have issues. I, You're just a worrier, like when you thought he was never going to talk. He was two, and all he could do was bark. I understood him. No. 
It's just so far away from everything she knows. And then there's the crazy ants and the frozen cows. Oh, please. In the last hour, your father publicly shamed Manny, dropped me from the sky while his wife drilled holes in our baby's head. Oh. Which is why I think we should revisit Claire and Phil. Where are my keys? We love Luke alone in a parking garage. <laughs> He's totally right. Lily. When something horrible happens, you're going to be all mine. It really is an if situation. <gasps> all mine. I don't mean to ruin this really beautiful moment, but were Phil and I even considered for the position? Claire? I mean, we are the parents of three healthy, well-adjusted children. Who I mean, we need to go down to the police station. Our daughter's just vandalized the school. No, no, this is not a Mother's Day breakfast. This is a breakfast that happens to You think to me of on. me as Lily's mother. I'm your wife. I'm a woman. What? There's nothing gays hate more than when people, people treat, treat us like, like women. women. We're not. We don't want to go to your baby shower. We don't have a time of the month. We don't love pink. You love pink. No, pink loves me. Glory and I are going to go finish this beautiful hike together while you sit here and think about how selfish and thoughtless you've been. Come on. If we're thoughtless, how can we think? Jay? Are you crying? No. It's the onions, damn it. Give me these. No, that's not what he said. You don't think I could throw a ball? Well, let's find out! Oh, God, he looks old. Oh, oh sorry! Can't hand. Sorry! Mitchell? All right. I'm good. Just... We had amazing seats for Lady Gaga, and he gets sick. I'd been looking forward to that concert for months. It's the one gay cliche I allow myself. So. Why do we have to do it now? Because Claire says so. Because I say so. And because I'm your dad. And I'm older than you. And I call the shots around here, right? Yes, you do. This is so unfair. Come on, guys, let's go have some fun. No, you're hurting me. Oh, you're fine. Go. Have fun, guys. Let's go, let's go, let's go. So, how does this usually start? Well, what, what is the difference between a bad doggy treat and the good doggy treat? Bacon. The bad doggy treat is very bland. But she seems like she likes it. Wait till you see the good doggy treat. Stella, sit. Now, a good doggy treat. Claire, they said we have to be at least 13 to ride the fast ones. They're 13? It's fine. <laughs> this is very confusing. At movie theater, she says I'm 11. You made him cry. He's not crying. You're not crying, are you? No. A little. It's just five years of my life are for nothing. Five. Five years. I'm starving. Me too. Um, Dad, we haven't had lunch yet. Neither have half the kids in Africa. Stop yapping and get back to work. Cam, you can say no, but I was thinking about maybe going to that concert. Thank you, you're the best. I love you. Family milestones always throw Claire for a loop. She holds it in, and then the next day she has a total meltdown, and I have to pick up the pieces. Problem is, tomorrow I'm supposed to go to Vegas with my buds, so I need her to melt down today. Otherwise, what happens in Vegas won't happen to me because I won't be there. I'm not calling from. Jay's calling. What's wrong with Jay? My clicker won't work. Oh my god, your heart's not working? How could you tell us it's over the phone? My heart is fine. Would somebody please press 9 and let me in? Okay. Got it. It won't work if you're both on the line. Okay. Okay. I've seen cattle, I've seen hogs, I've seen goats, I've even seen the three-legged... Whoa! Whoa! Oh, my God! Oh. Really, Mitchell? I could have just died. I got Botox. Stupid doctor talked me into it, and now it's drifting. I haven't felt this dumb since I shelled out 30 bucks for that bracelet. It's supposed to give me better balance. Try to push my arm down. Okay. Go ahead, you can't do okay. it. You can't right. do it. I am home. No one's ever going to talk to you again. So what? Mahatma Gandhi went on a hunger strike for what he believed in. That's because no one would eat with him in the cafeteria. 
Uh-uh. Now she's off to high school. Mm. Time marches on, huh? Yep. You know what's really sad? What? The end of Titanic. Hey, Luke. Do you realize in two years you and I will be graduating? Not now. I think I'm moving the ball with my mind. I was never valedictorian. What do I know? Thank you. I am doing this for a reason. It's not just like I'm... Uh -huh. Sorry, Alex, but you will thank me one day. Please, you really think I don't have duplicates? If you do this, you'll be a social piranha. Yes, I'll be an Amazonian carnivorous fish. Carnivorous? What? If you had been there, you would have laughed just as hard as I did. He's coming. So Stop talking. He's been embarrassed enough today. <gasps> do you want to drive? I do. Top, I called it. What was that? Oh, crap. The what? chain broke. Just keep pedaling. It doesn't matter. It matters a little. Principal Keisler, faculty, school board administrators, Fellow graduates, I got you. parents, and everyone who <coughs> helped us through this challenge. You have lost all credibility. It's it completely like different. Yesterday. How? It's, it's the juxtaposition of absurdist comedy against the backdrop of a formal yesterday. setting. Not a big bone man falling into a pool. Really? Shh. Later, this is about Alex. Stop! That's ours! We're up here! Stop! He ignored me! He didn't stop for the screaming sailor in a tree? You are the prettiest, smartest, funniest girl in the sixth grade. I know you're only 11, but I can't stop thinking about you. I've loved talking to you online. I think we should become boyfriend and girlfriend. Uh, no, it's not what you think. I'm talking to a little boy. Hello. She's not with me, Cam. I got her phone. Why are you crying? How do you get kicked out of a bakery? Well, that'll do it. Jay! Jay! Grandpa. We love you! Capiche? But he thought the cam's version was a little too artsy, so we've decided to take a few rugged shots at the ranch to, you know, balance it out. I don't think it needs balancing out. Really? It's called production value. I've never been this far from home before. Now I've never been this far. No, I've never been this far. I realized that if I was going to raise a boy, I needed to butch up my life. You know, I wanted to be able to teach my son all the things that my dad taught Claire. Good morning, princess. Good morning, Lily. But I need her to detach from me before the new thing comes, or who knows what she'll do to it. Why are you saying thing instead of baby? Kill a new baby. And there she is! Ah, oh, doesn't she look beautiful? Oh. She looks like she was dipped in glue and dragged through a flea market. Hi, uh, Jay Pritchett here. Holidays are just around the corner. I'm sorry, I don't believe in wrapping paper. Hey, do you guys have any old furniture? I'm moving into the attic. The attic? Hey, at least it's big. Grandpa said you used to live in a closet. Oh, in the water. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Shh. So I paddle over and I see he's got a plastic grocery bag wrapped around his neck and one of his fins, and I freaked. Tried to get it off with my paddle, didn't work, so I, I jumped in, but he disappeared under the water, and uh... Don't say it, don't you dare say it. And I never saw him again. Oh, this is the saddest thing I've ever mm. heard. Mm. And you put it off knowing that I would do it. Yes, are you happy? Yes, I am. I'll get you fixed up. Where's mom? She belongs to the people now. <coughs> My allergies are acting up again. Well, it is your lucky day because, Missy, Dr. Dad has everything you need. Behold the healing powers of grape flavoring. Where's mom? Some people took her. Drink this. Hi, I'm Ellen Roberts from the Adoption Agency. I'm here for the home visit. Oh. I might need to tweak my system. Listen, guys, your mom is taking on more responsibilities outside of the house, but don't you worry. 
Good old. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Oh my god, we have a run! Um, it's D1. I can't read it. Come on, it. let's go, let's go! Go where? We have to chase him down! No, no, you're not supposed to do that! Help, stop that car! He's getting away! Help! Hey, you almost got him, Cam. You almost got him. He's getting away! Please, it's really important. Look, I'd love to help you out, but I'm not very liquid right now. It's in a block of ice. I got the idea when I heard about rich guys with frozen assets. <laughs> assets. Before they leave. Are you sure? Go, I can handle it. You're not the first girl to leave me at this table with a plate full of chicken wings. I'm kidding. I wish I was kidding. Back straight. Okay, do as I do. Other leg. Okay, stop marching. You're dancing, not invading Poland. And I even told my mom about him. You better cherish him. Hello. Wow. <sighs> Are you sure you're gay? No. Cam. Yes. <gasps> okay, climb over. <laughs> you're fine. You guys are bullies. We can't be bullies. They're nerds. Don't pigeonhole us. We can be both. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Is there an issue here? Uncle Cam. I got this. Oh my god, it's Alex Dunphy. So awesome. Mm. 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 Roll up the curtain. Mm. Bing! I, I think you could make these simpler. Just, you know, sort of do them flatten on the side. Mm. Yeah, seems like that's how you like me. Flatten on the side. These geeks won't give us back our helicopter that we took from Reuben. Is that right, Abraham? Oh my god, she knows your name. A helicopter, please. I love you. 225. I just spent all my cash on groceries. Fine, but I'm taking the butterball. I don't know about that. That's it. I'm getting Mother's Little Helper. What? My mom keeps a stun gun for emergencies. This isn't an emergency. <laughs> oh, I stopped reading after dear friends, family, and others. I'm sorry, who are others? Me. And here's the money. <laughs> Oh no. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh gosh. You okay? Oh. Honey, I'm sure it's nothing. Claire, I'm tender under my arm. Maybe Luke hit you with his broomstick when you guys were playing Quidditch. I'm way too fast. He never touched me. Oh, oh, I, I, I wish I looked as good as this kid. please. You're freaking me out. Are you gonna die? I don't know. There's still a 5% chance I'll make it. It looks ridiculous. Mine is a distinguished professional award given to me by my peers, and yours was given to you on a peer. Okay, well, for your information, when I won this, it was a very big deal. I cut a ribbon at the grocery store and signed autographs. Best fishes, Cameron Tucker. <laughs> that is the most irresponsible, unprofessional thing I've ever heard of in my entire life. And do you have anyone to represent you in the sale of your current house? Look into his eyes. I don't care what the doctor says. I gave him six months. Stop staring. Yeah, but it's the most important question because it launches me into my big finish. That way people will leave excited. Oh, I think people will be excited to leave. Luke? Why? Well, I think he was following my lead. You know, a good leader can make all the difference. Actually, you were a little pitchy, but it was terrific, really. Thank you. <laughs> Yes, thank you for your opinion. Boy. I've got it! What if I'm the container? There's a thought. You could be... No, look! Look! A realtor's realtor! You were supposed to do my intro. Now I have to. Two-time non-consecutive winner of the Realtor of the Year Award. Just get back here by the end. Future investors, stop making excuses! Oh no, Cam, Cam, she's gonna look like little Bo Peep. Or little Bo Cheap. Look at this fabric, it's already pilling. Maybe it'll look better on. You mean, turned on? No, it does not. Cam! I love it. No, no you, you don't. don't. How would you respond to that, Councilman Bailey? I would like to use my lifeline.
I'll take this. If elected, I would consider all perspectives, and I would not ignore opposing <laughs> viewpoints. <laughs> Helicopter, just keep going. I, I would consider all perspectives, and I wouldn't ignore you opposing. Suck. You suck, Luke. You have to be ready for hecklers. He's right. Mm. Why are you swimming in your clothes? Because I'm self-conscious about my body. I am Phil Dunphy, and I am not a pervert. I, like a lot of men in this town, enjoy making love to my wife. I mean, um, I mean with their wives. Not me, them. Look, I should probably just sit down and say nothing, but it's too late. I am standing, and I'm obviously talking, and now you're looking at me, and I feel the need to keep going. Stop crying. But just because you have ice water in your veins doesn't mean that... No, no, Lily. N no, Lily. Oh, oh, he's fine. Oh, Daddy's not sad. Daddy, it's... Daddy. <laughs> it goes without saying I've always been proud of you. I mean, I brag about you all the time. So if I say, what do lawyers use as birth control, and the answer is their personalities, I want you to know I'm not referring to you. You don't need any birth control. Oh, thank God. Nobody's dead. I'm against it. Oh, surprise, surprise. Jay is against something. Cam and Claire want to have a baby together. Uh -huh. OK, you might want to slow down there. When I'm playing a new drinking game, it's called Every Time I'm Depressed, I Take a Drink. <laughs> that game exists. It's called alcoholism. We're not doing it because I don't want to do it. What we're not doing is not doing it because he doesn't want us to do it. Just say baby or no baby. <gasps> Isn't it enough this family spends a lot of time together? Now we have to inbreed. <laughs> oh! Oh! The hell. Oh, I don't like the sound of that. I said a little bit. The cap fell off. I said just go with it. Look, I can't fit more than 30 people on the boat, as I was just explaining to the lady here. Well, first of all, that lady is my son. He wasn't, he wasn't talking about me. Yeah. So walk away, Grandpa. You know what? Ooh. Nobody! Call him Grandpa! I do. No, are you crazy? Call 911! Oh, no, they're so busy. <laughs> I invented a new language this morning. Okay, okay. Cards on the table. It's not my favorite thing oh, that you Oh, how dare you. I am a clown. It's who I am. If you squeeze me, do I not honk? I roll. Oh, like I had a choice. Let, let me see it. Okay. All right. Oh! <laughs> yeah. um, Got it, thanks. <laughs> and you're not chewing gum, are you? No, I'm not. I just had some temporary dental work done. The last thing I had last week. Oh! And welcome back to A Matter of Record. I'm Cecil Van Gundy. Joining us now in studio is District 43 Town Council candidate Claire Dunphy. Thank you, Cecil. Manny and Gloria, thank you for making all those phone calls. And Dad, for all your support. I don't think I convinced anyone to vote for Claire. I don't think I even voted. I'm so sorry. sorry. But you know what? We are still just so proud of you. His lawyer said she wouldn't even honor his last request to toss his dog tags in the ocean. Can you imagine? Phil, do we really have to go through this again? I told you I would do everything possible to make sure that your skeleton ends up in a science class at a women's college. What do you think? I'm going to put these in the subway. Oh, OK. It looks like uh, Lily's missing, and we're offering $25 to get her back. Oh, don't be ridiculous. No one in their right mind. OK, that's all I see now. Stored it myself. No, I did not get in the little plane at the little airport. I'm not gonna get in this taka, 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 flown by that guy that could have fixed our car. Gloria, it's either this or we're in the motel. I don't like the sound of that. A lot of amenities disappear when an H becomes an M. You know, when I met you, you were eating cereal out of a bucket. Where's Bunny now? Uh, St. Louis. Why? He's visiting his girlfriend. He doesn't have a girlfriend. He has a boyfriend. Oh. All my stress completely disappeared. And so did my keys.
This is not the massage I had in mind. Oh, jeez. Dylan? Oh, hey. Uh, what are you? I didn't even know you were in town. Either did I. Look, Ruben, I have some underperformers I have to unload, and I don't have access to a computer. Log in as Money Delgado. Money! By all means, Ruben, go get a popsicle while the Nikkei closes. I want to be a popper. Come on. Mom, my stock just took a dive. Your phone is about to take a dive. It was nice to see you, Haley, and everybody. Hi. And dude, I don't know. I'm Ethan. It's nice to meet you. And polite dude, I don't know. All right. Is that a leash? No, it's a child safety tether. This way, sweetie. It, it's a leash. Don't, don't judge us. Okay, go on. We have a runner. Lily is going through a phase. At least, oh, we hope it's a phase. She bolts every chance she gets. Lily! 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 Okay, the Dapper Dans are a Main Street tradition since 1959. Hey, what's going on? <sighs> Nothing. I still love her, Ethan. Luke, wait up! I'll raise you there! I'm good. I'm good. I cannot walk around in public with these things. They're so yellow and so ugly. And, and they're so softy and so comfortable. Jay, what is this? Is this some sort of joke? Do I look like I'm joking? Dylan, let's not do this now. It has to be now. I've got a parade at three. Hey, seriously, dude, back off. OK. That was my face. <laughs> and you're the one who needs to back off. What? Am I being too loud again? All right, buckle up. Oh, I'm going to go and try to do the laundry. And I'm going to do it very quietly so I don't bother you. Maybe Manny can help me. Manny! I get it. Manny! I get it. Now you're not even making any noise. You're losing it! Just a few more seconds. I want turkey. Lily. Lily. Who are you talking to, Phil? Mitchell. Who? Mitchell, my bro uh, the lazy guy. I was doing you a favor. All right, just give me the cake. I'm hungry. No! Oh. Oh. Listen, <clears throat> I know that you're concerned, but I'm designing t-shirts now. They're going to be huge. Also medium and small. Dylan, would you excuse us for a moment so we can talk to Haley? Sure. But you stay. I'll go. You are driving to some California border town to adopt a baby, and I have to hear about it from Gloria? I was outside for two minutes. I kept it as long as I could. We're having a baby! Then we're going to add just a little party in the shoulders, all right? Now let's get those arms going. No, 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 no. Arms down here says I'm white and I'm sorry, but arms up here says you don't know what I am. I don't. En vez de a ti como su amante. <gasps> what was that for? The nurse stole her grandmother's almonds. I please just drive straighter. Oh, sorry, are my pinkies up again? I, they do that when I get excited. Down, girls. Oh, you look adorable. Adorable? I'm not a puppy. Oh, honey, it was meant as a compliment. Claire, I got this. Honey, you look super sexy. Enough! It wasn't the priest. It was me. Eduardo! Hey, hi. hi! What's happening? Yes, I am alive. And I may be just a ranch hand, but I am the one that told your abuela about the baby. I told her because I swore to your mother to look after your family. Your mother was my lover. Yeah. I would have mean, and now I go from English to Spanish. Que él no está can, can we please just see our baby? No. Abuela. Dylan, shut the door. <laughs> okay, put me back in the trunk. Relax, you're almost there. Nope, I'm done now. Nope. Hey, hey, no, Jay, no, no, you're no. Out. Hey, Jay! Oh. Jay! Jay! Oh, bitch! Somebody help me! I would, but put these pants of cashmere! What is your point exactly? That like the thrice married starlet, this cat is being deprived a stable home. I'm sorry if you're upset. You're the one who should be upset, ma'am. We are animal lovers. That cat would have been on the receiving end of affection 24 hours a day. Satisfying its every need would have been our top priority. Hey, let's do some fishing. I'm starting to feel better now that I'm finally getting dry. Let's do this. Let's do All it. Right. I don't know why I have to go to this thing. In case you've forgotten, I raised two kids. Uh -huh. Ow. 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 Stop. Ow. 
pulling my hair. Stop twisting my nipple. Ow, that hurts. Oh, Lily, honey, sweetheart, come here. Come here. If you ever put your hands on my daughter again, I will string you up by your feet, run you up the flagpole, and let the birds peck out your eyes. You understand? You have gay men. And straight men. Both the same gender. Then you have gay men. And straight women. Both attracted to the same gender. But gay men and lesbians? No. Nothing. Nice and snug. Like a burrito. Done. I win. It's not a race. Darn right, it wasn't even close. <laughs> OK, it's good, but it's a little tight. It's a burrito. You don't want the meat to fall out? He squeezed my butt. He what? Ew. I thought it was you. Believe me, sir, I'm a respected realtor. This is an innocent mistake. Honey, turn around and show him your, your butt. It's, it's uncanny. Dad, I am very normal. Please do not judge me based on them. Are those your my little pony sheets? What? No. Oh. I ordered them online. They must have sent the wrong ones. I'm very sorry. That's what was in the box. Oh. Babies are tougher than you think. When I was five years old, my babysitter was a goat. If you ask me, sometimes we get so hung up on our differences, we forget the one thing we have in common. When it comes to the safety and well-being of our children, we're all a little bit nuts. You have dainty little hands just like your daughter. You have boots like my dad. Watch the sunrise at least once a day. If you love something, set it free. Unless it's a tiger. If you're ever in a jam, a crayon scrunched up under your nose makes a good pretend mustache. When life gives you lemonade, make lemons. Life will be all like, what? This is hard. Hey, Cam. Who's hungry? Oh, were you thinking about dropping by for lunch? Again? You know, I, I really wish I could, but it's, uh, it's a zoo around here. Um, but hey, Cam. Cam, would you mind uh, stopping by Longinus's boutique and picking up a few shirts for me? Sure. Thank you. Or we can do it together. Hey. Hey. Hi. Hi. How are you? Good. OK. I don't know what you're doing. Should I wave? Did your boyfriend take the job? Oh my god, that looks so good on you, Cam. Don't even. It is everything I can do to not create a scene right now. You will pay for this. Mm. And this. And this. I mean, I was pretty hysterical. You calmed me down. I, I don't think you're the guy you used to be. So you're saying that if I can deal with you, then I can handle any other little girl? I think I'd put it up. No, but I, I, mean, I, think, I, think, I think that's right. But you still got to walk through. So you can either go kicking and screaming. Knock your pot, old big guy. Find another foxhole. This is how we learn to sing. Buzz, time's up, dummy. It's Olympia. Make sure you sound out the big scary words. <laughs> Mom, something's on my mind and it's really bothering me. Yeah, it's really bothering me too, but I think it's gonna be rich, so we better be nice to it. Keep your eye on Lily. She has a tendency to wander off. Cam! Of what, what, I'm, I'm totally capable of... You lost her, didn't you? No, 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 no. She is right next to me. Hi, honey. I can hear it in your voice. Look in the dairy case. Cam, do you honestly think that I would lose? Doors don't pull, they slide. Even if he is one in a million, what's our best case scenario here? He becomes what? A, a professional, professional magician. magician. Honey, the boy has a gift. You want to just throw that away? I don't think it's about throwing it away. I think it's about don't you. Don't I get to say any of this? I'm sorry I don't like magic as much as you, but I don't. This isn't about magic. No, it's about my life and you controlling it. Look, you made a commitment. You will honor that commitment. Ugh, I hate it here. So now, let's form an orchestra made up of my favorite instruments, your beautiful bodies. It's getting creepy. You got to stop doing this. I'm not sure if it's the pregnancy, which we both know isn't your fault. 
Trick or treat. Trick or treat. You guys don't even have costumes. I'm a skeleton. I'm, I'm a lemon. Huh? Do you think I'm a hothead like Manny? No. You can be emotional, volatile, maybe. Still, that's a far cry from. You put that on my house. I care what you love. Oh, these aren't for sale. Hey, this is for charity. You know you're taking those jeans out of the hands of some needy giant children. I don't know, Claire. You could be wrong. Boys aren't as concerned about traditional masculinity anymore. You know, they're not butching it up. They're not pushing down their feelings. Yeah, they care about their clothes. Mm -hmm. they, they, they groom. Mm -hmm. Everybody's hairless. Uh, you, know, you can't tell anything anymore. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. hey, hey, Uncle Mitch, mm. Uncle Cam, this is Michael. Hi. Hello. Hi. OK, come on. Yep, he's gay. We stand corrected. Oh, that's too bad, because you look so cool on that. Do I, Claire? Do I really? What happened? It's a long story. Check your inbox. This better be good. <sighs> Haley got arrested for drinking. We gotta go bail her out. Do you still have a connection to that judge upstate? He died. I who died? An old friend of mine. Hi, oh, Jay, I'm so sorry. He died five years ago. And then why are they calling us in the middle of the night to wake us up? Nobody died. died. Haley's in jail. Okay, that makes more sense. Claire has Mitchell, I can't talk right now. Cam, it's Claire. My phone died. I just wanted to make sure the kids got to school okay. Oh yeah, of course they did. Why wouldn't they have? I uh, hear we got a boy who can't breathe. Mm -hmm. Right here. What was that? Oh, I'm just watching an original Lifetime movie called The Boy Who Can't Read. That sounded like Alex. Nope, just Amanda Bynes. Look, this has got to be some kind of mistake. Our daughter's tiny. There's no way she assaulted anyone. Insulted, maybe. Was was the cop wearing white socks and dark shoes? Because that really sets her off. Oh, oh God. Okay, look, the opening is supposed to be in the back. No way. I don't want people to see my butt. You know what? Now that you're doing better, I think I should call your mom and tell her what happened. You know, I know it was a bit of a rough ride in the beginning, but the important thing is, is I handled it. And everybody's okay. What happened to her? Uh oh. She passed out watching a C-section. Cam. Mm -hmm. Never mind! Honey, we have an hour until the competition. Do you want to go to the contestants' mixer? No, I don't want to humanize them. My daughter went on to win the whole thing, and all I could think was, I just flushed four dollars down the toilet. John Calvin. <laughs> Woo, Alex! I know this sounds crazy, but I feel like my whole life has led to this moment. You made a very similar speech to get my mom to stop for those churros. Look, I need you for this. You're sneakier than I am. You're a bigger liar. You have no moral compass. Look, thanks for all the compliments. See, this is a nightmare. Tell me about it. You know what? You're a list maker, a planner. I'm a doer and an action taker. Sean Penn would play me in a movie about this, or Anne Hathaway if they wanted a female-driven vehicle. And who would play your long-suffering partner? Julianne Moore, either way. I would totally see that. I would. Hey, my supervisor wants to know if you have a history of mental illness. I'm Mexico, again. Does anybody care that I'm not from Mexico? You keep saying that, but we've never seen a birth certificate. Your partner's so worked up, why isn't he here? Oh, well, that's a very good question. It's because he starts things and he doesn't finish them, so then I have to. Just like my wife. You know, a therapist would say, we're enabling them. Are you and your therapist? Yeah, well, I wouldn't have to see him if you hadn't shot that guy. Hello? Claire, Phil doesn't want the house either, all right? He's letting me take the fall. He's a liar. And a clever one. Hey! Howdy, life partner! <laughs> what? Are you serious? <gasps> That's fantastic! Oh, I gotta tell Phil. I'll call you right back. What's, what's up? <laughs> Mitchell changed his mind. He's all for it. We're flipping a house! Yeah! Well, hello, Phil. To what do I owe this pleasure? Do you really want your unborn baby to hear you fighting like this? Studies show it's unhealthy for a fetus to be exposed to a stressful environment. Studies? You're 13. Read a comic book. Oh, and I suggest you lose this number. Mitchell? Mitchell! Who's watching me? Haley. I'm serious. Alex. OK, let's go. Fine. What do you want? You have to keep your door open. Why? Uh, well, why do you need it closed? Because we're going to make out. Oh, um, well, you, you can't have your door closed. Why? Do you want to watch or something? That's weird. So, you making any resolutions? Yeah. No more blind dates. You're mean. You know, she's right, Joyce. You are mean. I've been a gracious host while you've been rude, sullen, and dull. You'll forgive me if I choose not to start the new year on such a negative note. Oh. And if you're hungry for broccoli later, you'll find a piece in your teeth. I'm coming in. What are you doing? Just putting away some laundry. 
That's a bra and a tablecloth. And look who I'm sitting next to. Oh, she has no idea. Hello, I'm Billy D. Williams. Hello, I'm Gloria D. White. Oh, I hate you. You hate me now, but someday you'll thank me. I think I owe Mom a huge apology. Is anyone watching me? You finally got married! Hooray! Ow! <laughs> oh, are you okay, sweetie? What do you think? <clears throat> Gloria asked me to record Manny's birthday. Mom! Alex! Give it back to your bra. Oh, sorry, I tried to care. Stop it right now. Is it getting romantic? Mm. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Oh. Okay, let's get your hospital band off. I like it. Okay, that can be your something blue then. Cam? <laughs> Daddy, I want to drive my car. A car? Oh, the car. Just a second, sweetie. Okay, does anyone know a reason why these two shouldn't be wed? She's my wife. We're gonna be talking about this one for years to come, aren't we? You said it, Kenny. Manny seems to me like a like a real old soul. Kenny is amazing at telling the age of a soul. Mm -hmm. Aw, thanks, babe. <laughs> age is nothing but a state of mind, you know? Yeah. I mean, I'm probably more of a 14-year-old than he is, and mm -hmm. <laughs> believe me, I know 14-year-olds. He has a 14-year-old daughter. Oh, yeah. Oh, cool. Somebody pick up that towel before someone trips. Oh, that's a strong grip. Uh, that's it, that's oh. it, that's it, that's it. That's it. Oh. She's getting close. She's at like eight beautiful centimeters. Hey, I don't think we've met. I'm Kenny. Hi, I'm disgusted. Good, because I wanted to give you a birthday present. Actually, I'd like to see your face. It's harsh, I know. I've begged them to put in a dimmer. Mitchell, she won't even look at me. Well, she can't really look at anyone, you know. Do I have to wear it today? It's kind of hard to close my shirt over it. Oh, no, 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 no. You do whatever you want, padrecito. I know that's the way in this house. But if you wear it, oh, you make me proud. The hell is that? Some kind of a gay protest thing? It's a candle, Dad. No more. I want my own life, my own bed, my own email account. And with the new baby, Gloria's been bugging me to have more patience. But come on, he's been alive a month. How hard is it to support your own head? So bring it, Jay. You stink, Phil. You're the worst thing to happen to golf since they let people wear shorts. Um, permission to speak off the record? Denied. OK, fine. Well, then see for yourself in just a moment. Tonight, a star will be born. Cam? Not now, Manny. I'm birthing something. I'm just excited to find someone who enjoys the sport as much as I do. Well, <clears throat> I'm gonna be straight with you, Carl. You got a ton of inventory to move, and you're in need of a serious realtor. Clip up! Voila. Square knot. Impressive. I can make any kind of knot. It's like I have a sailor in my mouth. What is that? You think the kids are home? That sounds like more than our three. Oh. Well, they think we're not home, and they're having a party. I'm killing them. No, 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 no. Enough. Turn off the music. Everybody who I did not create, get out of my house right now. Oh, my god, stop now. We can only screw it up from here. Please, you're in the hands of the master. I think I know how to pick up a 14-year-old girl for you. I guess what I'm trying to say is, oh, my god, he's going to sing. So many years living life underwater Came up for air in the room of your daughter Never knew I would find my answer In my ex-girlfriend's uncle's house With the tiny pink panther Let me take a look at this. Hey! Hey! I gotta get ready. All right, let's go before this wears off. I think we have a few days. Sorry you couldn't come to the wedding. It was no kids. It's OK. I'll go to your next one. <laughs> wow. Yeah, she, just, she just means when she's not a kid anymore. You know. She knows what I mean. I don't like you. I'll get over it. <gasps> this is so stupid. What if I spill on her or accidentally brush my boob against her hand? I mean. Her hand against my boob. Dude, stay cool. You got this. I'm going to be at the bar the whole time. If you start to panic, just come get me. Shh, there she is. <laughs> what was that? I don't know. I've never heard it before. All right, close your eyes. Why? Just trust me. OK. 
Ah, ow. Now you close your eyes on the court. But you told me. Don't let me get in your head. Pop them. Pop them all before they hit the ground. Go. I don't really understand how. Make a fist with your thumb on the side. Now bring your thumb to the front. OK, now do it again. Ha, you just spelled ass in sign language. <laughs> I'm telling you how handsome you are. Oh, well, next time tell me in English so I don't miss it. You're forgetting all your Spanish. You never practice. Perdóname, mami, soy embarazada. You just told me that you're pregnant. So we'll do a little shopping. We can have our pretty nails done and our pretty hair. Do you think that's fun? Yeah. And you know what the best part of having a girl's day is? That you can ask me anything you want. Did you know I'm gay? Come on, Lily is not gay. It's probably just a phase. Oh my God, did I just say that? Do not tell anyone I just said that. Here, Mom wants to talk to you. Dad wants to talk to you. Hello? Alex, book down, run a brush through your hair. You're going on that trip with your friend. What? Haley, I love you. If you don't want to work in that store, I'll help you find something you like better. Is this reverse psychiatry? So Gloria was telling us about something that you said, mm -hmm. something about you being gay. What about it? Okay, very aggressive, just saying. Uh, well, we're just wondering, you know, why did you say that? Because I'm gay. But why do you think you're gay, sweetie? We're learning about it in school. Oh. My friend Aldo's parents are Italian, so he's Italian, and you and Daddy are gay, so I'm gay. Oh. <laughs> Mom, you're freaking me out. Why is everyone screaming? Here. Here. This is Luke. I want to go home. No, it's important that you celebrate the culture of your ancestors. You are Vietnamese. No, I'm not. I'm gay. I'm gay. Honey, no, you're not gay. You are just confused. Oh my god, what is wrong with me? It's like a... Oh, please, we have tons of lesbian friends. Here's what we know. Mom had to go to the hospital for a simple procedure. Then, Mom and Dad start calling us acting weird. Open your eyes, people. They've been kidnapped. It's just that I feel like I'm losing my children to America. They're just going to grow up and become boring old white people. Oh, most of our friends are white, actually. Okay, can everybody just calm down and go back to their own conversations? Just thank you. Maybe I'll just take Manny and Joe to Colombia this summer. I think that's a great idea. I really think that keeping in touch with your heritage only enriches our culture. Absolutely. I think we would all be better off if people would go back to where they came from. Uh-oh. No, I got this. Is it a play, a book, or a movie? Yeah, yeah, one of those. Lost, clueless, dazed and confused. OK, before you say no. No. You haven't even seen it yet. I'm sticking with no. It's for Luke's career day. I thought I'd offer the kids a chance to put their face on my body. Ew. Yeah. Thank you, Dr. Ann, for showing us how exciting and surprising a real live therapy session can be. I will hold on to this card. <laughs> Next up, we have Luke's dad, Mr. Dunphy. Hey. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Guess what? I've been in your house when you weren't home. I'm writing because I made a mistake and gave you too much money. Please leave the $100 under your pillow tonight, and I'll give you a dollar. Sorry if that bites. Oh. Let me see that. I can't read. Gil Pickles. Genius. So much better than my fillow cases. I never got this. If he sees it, we'll have to talk about it. What? What, what? You know, I've got problems of my own. I can't always be the lovable sidekick on the Manny show. Did you even notice I'm binge eating? <laughs> Fell the road. No! Ah! I don't know what button I just pressed, but that was amazing. Funny thing, pride. They say it goeth before the fall, fall, fall. Mitchell, I can hear you rooting for a little girl to fall. If I can hear you, other people can hear you. Oh, yes! Oh. I don't know why I said that. I don't, I'm sorry. Look what my dad just gave me. Please tell me that's not your mom. The only influence my client was under that night was his love of boating. Shame! 
Hello again. Oh, no, you're alone. Did you fire that nice girl? No, she's not a nice girl. She's my wife, and we don't sell vacuums. Thank God you'd starve. Oh, boy. Dear Phil, you've always been the most wonderful son, and now I need you to do one last thing for oh, me. Oh, no, she's going to ask me to throw her ashes in the Pope's face. I know, isn't it? <laughs> oh, 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 okay. Oh, that's Mitchell. Gotta go. Oh, don't let him hear the excitement in your voice. You're right. You're right. What? I saw a doctor. He found a small, dark mass. What are you? And then just as he begins to cry, you pull out a black box with the ring in it. There's your small, dark mass. It's genius. Y you're a disaster. You can go the disaster route, too. Did you ever hear how I told Phil we were going to have Luke? I said thousands of children die every day. Little heads up, there's no way I'm not crying at this wedding. Phil, you cried on the way here. Be careful! What? Mm. Wow, look at your eyes. Oh, I, I can't. Daddy's office? You sound like a little girl. Helen and I really miss the kids, but we just can't afford to visit them right now. If you consider the reverse mortgage. What's that? Well, you have equity in your home, right? Sure. I humbly accept your offer. Huddle up, boys! Let's go, hustle! Do you know what hustle means, Ten? That sounds too good to be true. Oh, don't take my word for it. Uh, here's Henry Winkler to tell us more. I don't want the fathers to see me like this. In the past, I've had trouble letting someone else call the shots. All mothers were. Look at him, rosy-cheeked. He's playing with his blocks. Ah, the six again. He's really learned to let things go. Oh, no, God, no, no, no. Uh... OK, well, why don't you give me an example of something you haven't told me because you were worried I couldn't handle it? Go on. All right. Last week, when we were supposed to have lunch and you canceled, mm -hmm. <sighs> Beyonce was at the restaurant. OK, uh, the singer or Pepper's dog? What's this? Oh, um, that's an action figure. It's two groomed. They melted together in the car on a very, very hot day. It's 103. Oh, I, you know I can't stay mad at you when you buy me glasses, you son of a bitch! I'm going to answer it. No, you can't. Yes, I can. We're practically family. Hey, dude, it's Cam. Where? I'm fine, okay? Sometimes when you read to me, I pretend to fall asleep so you'll go. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I am late. Traffic was horrible. Sounds like someone could use a tall drink of water. It's fine. If he's old enough to watch The Walking Dead with me, he's then not. he's old enough to stay home alone. He's not. Claire, he's not a little boy anymore. <laughs> I'm fine. See how deep his voice is? Gloria! Let's go. You know she's not here, right? What? She's having her hair blown out. That's a thing that I pay for? Lily, it's time to play who wore it best. No, I'm not doing this again. I can't. Fine, Alex. Uh, I don't know. Boys' clothes aren't really my thing. Really? Here, let me lighten your load. Who are you? I'm the new Manny. Am I being replaced? So if I'm hearing you right, you're not so much mad about the prostitute in the kitchen as you are about my lying to you. No, I'm mad about the prostitute in the kitchen. Mm. The idea of two men being able to marry <laughs> seemed like a fantasy. So I see you riding down the purple aisle on a unicorn. Gosh dang it. My dad warned me about that when I turned 14. He said, son, you're about to be the man of the family. You got to learn to give people time to see how special you are. Why were you the man of the family? Uh, he sort of died. How? I don't want to bring you down, little man. Neither did my dad. He'd say, my disease can't be all bad if it rhymes with answer. I got all day and satellite radio. I don't care if parking here is on your bucket list. I got two books on tape, a space blanket, and a protein bar in the glove box. I will sleep here if I have to. You know what might make you feel better? Gathering my team and putting the fear of God in them. I was going to say a churro. I could do both. She's a mess. Girl. Get your vanilla fingers away from my shirt. Blouse. OK. You want to talk about clothes? Let's talk about clothes. Let's go. 
Let's see, you look like some kind of old washed up golf pro who drank his way off the tour and is one step away from writing the suicide note with one of them little pencils. If Jay sees this- I know. Dad, you got three good men here depending on you. Say no more. I'm gonna tap a button now that's either gonna make you larger on my screen or... We've lost Florida. I hope she's not still out in the field. Lily! You can't just call her like a pig. Lily! If I had known him then like I know him now, I never would have tried to get rid of Phil. Good night. Get rid of Phil? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? You and Rita had an affair. No, we didn't. That's crazy. Well, okay, good night. I'm looking at my first month ever without a sale. Some people might give up, but those people aren't Phil Dunphy. No! Now, is this an I activity or a we activity? We. What? We. What? We. 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 That's right. We. Now you sound like dolphins. And anything a little girl can do, I can try to do too. Stop being so excited, all right? We might be able to get the price down a little bit. It's okay, poker face, poker face. Yeah, now work on your poker voice. Poker voice. So, we do like it. We're just not sure that we love it. Yeah, we're not sure we love it. I have some literature if you want it. That's okay, save the paper. I haven't printed anything since 2004. I was gonna email you. On your power-hungry computer? My entire house is solar-powered. I sell energy back to the grid and use that money to save polar bears. I'm an environmental lawyer, so, <laughs> you know, I'm pretty green. Mm, so is your lawn. I went drought tolerant. Succulents, indigenous plants, rock garden. My other daddy says your yard looks like a litter box. She's a cute kid. I remember when she was in disposable diapers. Tracy McCoy's a student of mine. Okay, I may have a plan. I am not having a wedding slash Hunger Games themed Sweet 16 Oh, you're tapping your fingers. You really do have a plan. Here we go, everybody. Hey, honey. We all know why we're here. I honey, you missed one. I know! I want to see a therapist. I did some research. Dr. Gregory Clark highly recommended, specializes in teenagers, and is covered by our insurance. I booked a double session with him today, and since you guys have the open house, I will be taking the bus. Okay. That sounds good. She's like a self-cleaning oven. Are you ready? Yeah. Why do you look like that when I look like this? My friends say it's because of your money. We can't go in the teacher's lounge. Why not? Um, it's for teachers only. You're a teacher. Right now you're teaching me how to be a little bitch. You know, no, no one wants to be friends with me. I, I can't tell you the last time I had people over for dinner, which is probably a good thing. You know, with solar power, it takes four days to roast a chicken. Really? If you want to cook all the way through, yeah. Mm. You know, I had salmonella three times. Well, that Brian sure is a cutie, huh? I'd kill to have those lips. I mean, on me. I mean, I want his lips on my mouth. Uh, can we just cut to the chase? He's got great lips. No, no, no. Will you make me the happiest man on earth and be my bride. What? <laughs> oh my God. No. 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 Sorry. Did you know that this place used to be a bank? But you do. You push people away so when they leave, it doesn't hurt that much. I don't get it. You're the greatest generation. But why can't you feel? I can't believe this. You, you don't love me? No. No. Sorry. No. I need some air. So, Syria, any updates? No, nothing yet. Nothing. You call me, okay? Every day. <laughs> Every damn day. If I'm being honest, this is a little girlier than I thought. Ugh. Buddy, yeah. Whoa. What's all that about? You mad at me or something? I don't know. Did you do something to make me mad? Because then I am. But if you didn't, then I am not. I didn't do anything. Then I am not mad. Olympic and 20th. Yeah. That's the old salvage yard where kids go to get high. What? No. Oh, we are going there right wait, now. Wait, wait, Are you sure? I'm going to answer, and then I'm going to walk away. Deal? OK. I'm 420% sure. Wow, she's bad at math. It's so dark down here. Be careful, sweetie. <laughs> What are you doing? I'm 
just watching you sleep. You look so pretty. Okay, but don't breathe so loud. Hey, where are you going? This is so wrong. Ah, uh, well, desperate times call for desperate. What is on your head? It provides glare protection, but apparently not from you. I trust you. <laughs> Fine, I gotta go. I gotta, I don't know what I have to do. Hey, get off my kid! Hey, hey, get off my kid! Ah! Get off of my kid! Hey, hey, get off my daughter's husband! It knocked me off my game. On the board. Oh! I am an experienced, respected attorney, and on my first day, you asked me to bathe Rex. I'm not comfortable with that. And I'm not comfortable with that, but I did it. Um, are you sure you know what you're doing, Tad? I know you're the mortgage doctor, Someone but... said, is there a doctor in the house? Was I supposed to not get up? Which one of you is J.J. McCubbin? <laughs> oh, hey, quick question, J.J. Why is a great mortgage rate like your wife in bed? Once a month and low interest. And we also asked Claire to go because we thought her sensible style nicely complements Gloria's flair. That way, Lily doesn't end up looking too... <laughs> or to wah, wah. And I don't have all day to try on dresses. Oh, and I do? It'll be fun for me. You're my stepdaughter. I'm older than you. You see, it's already fun. I want to do something crazy. OK, I'm going to order a bath. Sir, it sounds to me like you've gone mad. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> OK, this is what I want. I want something romantic, but also a little dangerous. Romantic, dangerous. Might I suggest, sir, the techno bath? Your heart will throb with the bass while your eyes take in an off-the-scale laser light show from that most intimate of VIP arenas, your own tub. We're all obviously tense. Let's take a deep breath, get in the tub. It's not happening. Ah, uh, get yourself out of some hot water by getting her into some. Wow, so good. Might I suggest the Michael Bublé bath? You are a mind reader. I'm not a mind reader, sir. I've just been in the bath butling business since the early 90s, despite my fresh face, so I tend to know what these situations need. You, you lull me with this, with this hacky quick change, and the whole time you're changing the fake dog into a hot maid? It's brilliant. It's magic. No, that's metamorphosis. The scotch delivery you have me on the lookout for, sir? I think you're going to love my wedding board. I'm pretty excited, too. Veto. 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 How am I supposed to do this with so many eyes on my rack? Oh, sorry. Where's Luke? How long does it take him to get the dictionary? We described it for him perfectly. It's gone. What is? The cake topper. Lily, have you seen the little daddies you were bathing with earlier? Oh, don't say that. Beach it is. Let's get this Aussie party started. Oh my god, what's wrong with your mouth? Hi, your lips are huge. I think you're allergic to the vegemite. What is this? Not one topless woman. Calm down. You're gonna spook the boobs. Tab, we can't just up and leave without a plausible reason why. Ah. Claire's hurt! Good day, mate. Hey. Aren't you good? Penny for your thoughts? Boobs. Getting pretty good, huh? Yeah, but you were always good. I'm just glad you stuck with it. Seriously? What? It's playing itself. Well, I didn't know. You honestly thought that I just became a piano virtuoso, Dad? You've known me my whole life. Have you ever seen me take a lesson? I thought maybe you were self-taught. Uh, I'm sorry, you're right. Like when I taught myself to play the clarinet. Exactly. I never played the clarinet. Can we drop it? Let's go get an ice cream. What about my lactose intolerance? Oh, I'm not loving this game. That is a really cute dress. Oh, yeah, thank you. Just got it yesterday. Really? It reminds me of something I gave you six months ago. Do you ever put her in the girls' hand-me-downs? Oh, yeah, all the time. Really? Because if my girls' old clothes aren't to your taste, I could always just give them to somebody else. OK, calm down, Claire. Your voice is getting to that pitch that disturbs our cat. Like that, guys. Go that way. I'll distract him. Excuse me? Haley? Oh, my god, Kevin. It's Keith. You really don't remember the guy you abandoned at Coachella? Pet Stella's belly. What? You won't touch Stella's belly. Yeah, because it's the creepiest thing ever. It has like 30 nipples. Quick, we need a blow dryer. Is this some sort of gay emergency? 
You need money for the wedding. Why sell something that you love? Why don't you just ask Jay? No, no, no. Why no, not no. his your father? I don't feel right asking my dad for money, okay? I'm an adult and I have my comic book. Well, I guess we have different definitions of emergency then. You know, I'm just gonna say it. 911 dispatchers have a little bit of attitude. Well, you requested a SWAT team. We're gathered here today to join these two in holy matrimony. Do you take him to be your lawfully wedded spouse? And the first person says, I do. Right. Then I ask the second person, do you take him to be your lawfully wedded spouse? You know the drill, right? I do. Then I say, by the powers vested in me by the state of California, I now pronounce you legally wed. Bingo, bango, bongo, you're married. Awesome. I'm so glad you're here. I get us into these situations, and I freak, and then you always fix the problem. Well, no, we each have our own gifts. It's just, yeah, it's easier for me to stay calm in the face of, oh, my God! Oh, oh, oh my God! Daddy, oh, for you! My God. No, I mean, I don't think you need the magic trick, but if you do it, I'm sure you'll be great. Oh, honey. Oh, oh God, oh. let me get that. Still. Honey, no! no. Honey, no! Hey! Still. Cue the quartet. Where's the other one? He rode with Decatur, who flipped this truck. Why do good things happen to everyone but me? Let's send the flower girl before she's a flower teenager. Mitchell, is this really how you want to get married? Well, it's not ideal. No, you know, people don't have any rice to throw up because they're chewing it raw out of starvation. Half of our guests are on the lawn, and <laughs> there go the sprinklers. OK, now, Lily, press the red button. I'm breaking the window! I raise you up the stairs. Why don't you slip into something less comfortable? Okay. <laughs> Surprise! Surprise! Ah! Cam. What's up, dude? Seriously? What, is that too romantic for you? Uh, he loves me not. He loves me not. He loves me not. No, he don't want to put eso. No! Si, 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 claro. Manny! Come, talk to your cousins. Hola! Manny, why you freeze the Colombian? You can't leave us. We're a danger to ourselves. We're a family of fire starters, poison eaters, and online prostitutes. Lily, we're ready for dinner. Oh. Big smiles. Great. Good. Let's take a look. He made it for you himself. No. In a pottery class he's been taking for weeks. No! And you smashed it on the counter, and he was too embarrassed to say anything. No! I can take it! Glue! Okay, give me glue! I need glue! Ah, I can't believe I was gonna hit you over the head with that chair. Wait, so now we're not pushing the button? No, we're supporting Haley. For the rest of your life. That is not helpful. First of all, all kids go through this. You should see every picture we have of Luke from third grade. He looks like he's mid-sneeze, which is a shame, because I was having a great boob year. What did you do? I think it might have been the birth control I was taking, but... No, come on, about Luke. Oh, nothing. We didn't do anything. Oh, Mitchell, I say this with love, but when you became a parent, I knew this was going to be a problem for you, because you like to control everything. Good Lord, what would that sound like without love? Give me touched. Now, sad. Sadder? Come on, dig deep. Think about me going off to college. Why are you smiling? Uh, I didn't think you'd get in. Feels good. Wait a minute. How are they going to know we're sending them a message if we're not doing anything? That's true. We have to hit that button. Damn straight. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Who did that? We did. As a family. If you see even the tiniest problem, point it out. My dad died 25 years ago today. <laughs> Call dad. Paul Rudd is an American film and television actor. Shut up. May your first marriage be as happy as my second. To the grooms. Wait a minute, I take that back. Oh, that's so bad. To my sons. Oh. <laughs> So, when I say Marco... Hi, Marco. No, no, I'm Phil. I'm gonna say Marco, and then... Hi, Phil. No, and of course, I would never suggest special treatment for Lily, even if she is a, a former orphan and minority and, and daughter of two gay men. It's a big load on those little shoulders. Are you suggesting that your daughter is at a disadvantage because she's being raised by gay parents? Is it working? Okay. 
That's them. That's them. Everybody look like you're gardening. Luke, grab that little hoe. Uh, I, I don't think that's what she meant. Is it? Is there another buyer? I really shouldn't say. <gasps> is this... Is this one of those realtor tricks? No. Where you're trying to get me to raise my offer? Oh, no. Well, it's working. All right, I'll throw in another 50 grand. What? That's a terrible idea. I'm not losing the house. I had the best sex of my life in there. When? Oh, here comes Dad. He's going to be all like, no, what did you do? Where's Awesome Land? No, what did you do? Where's Awesome Land? But Spanish just doesn't seem natural to me. I don't like the way it hits my ear. What could be more natural than your mother's tongue in your ear? Sorry, I snapped. She's been like this all day. There you go. That never worked on you. So good to see you guys. I don't know why I just did that. But what this case... As I was saying, what this case is about is dignity. The dignity of those we settle... And we need to take these people, and we need to get them back. Court <laughs> Randall Lape, I gotta see you win. Congratulations. Thank you. Uh, are you wearing makeup? Oh, well, just on my face and my ears and my neck and my hands, yeah. So, sweetie, we bought you that pretty new Thanksgiving dress. But I want to wear this. She wants to wear that, Cameron. Thoughts? <clears throat> I had one parent growing up who wanted to be my friend, and another one who didn't care about that. Guess which one is still in my life? Delicious homemade bread? That looks like just regular white bread. You two bread seem that... drunk. This will soak up the booze. I don't think I want a tattoo when I have old skin. Mm -hmm. Haley, if you don't get daughter, it's going to look like I did this for my mother, and then I'm going to have to saw my leg off. Or you could just add to it. Hey, what's Sanskrit for issues? Mm, it's too heavy. Well, that's tough, because I'm not carrying it for you anymore. I like this new guy, huh? <laughs> oh! So I've been trying to think of a phrase that sums up the way I live my life. I don't think small. I don't do things halfway. I'm not afraid of taking risks. So then I was trying to think of the perfect place to put it, you know? You don't want to put it on a, a body part that's going to wrinkle or, or sag too much. And you don't want it in some place where if you're wearing a suit, it would show. True. So on my lower back, I will put the words, go deep, bam. Think about that. I heard it. Okay. Um, do it. Mm -mm. No. All in. No. Oh. We just rolled a bipolar divorce. He face first onto a hardwood floor. All to protect a couch. It's not just a couch. Ah! Oh, let's show him what we got. Hey, real quick. What do we got? Um, well, I can raise the roof into the cabbage patch. Okay, and I can do the single lady hand yeah, thing. Yeah, but put your neck into it or you just look like the queen waving. Oh, good point. Hey, where have you guys been? The San Vicente branch of the, the public, public library, library and then ice, ice cream. cream. That was a weirdly specific answer. I have to show them that I am a serious thinker. And you could be a bit more supportive. You're right. I'm sorry. Your outfit's perfect. Thanks. If you're applying to lumberjack school. And majoring in having your cats eat you when you die. <laughs> I read Clifford, the big red dog. And I read Richard Chamberlain's autobiography. Did you know he did Hamlet in London? Yes, I remember you telling me about that at the San Vicente branch at the public library. Oh. So, I see here that you're on the debate team, and you play the cello. Yes, but I am so much more than that. I'm also a part of the French club. Tell me more. Mm. I tried to be supportive for Lily. I really did, but I wanted to kill myself. Right. I'm gonna see you tonight at Rana's party, right? Oh, yeah. Okay. What party? Oh, the two saddest words in the English language. Maybe this is part of a bigger plan. You know, maybe the reason we didn't adopt another baby after Lily was because God wanted us available for Sammy. Who is this God that denies us a baby, then gets a party girl pregnant, only to have her desert the baby so that we can finally get one? The same God that impregnated a virgin, sent Moses down the river in a basket, and commanded Abraham to stab his own son. God only does weird baby stuff. <laughs> Tomorrow morning, I may have to make it an early one. Are you sure? Because you only have one night with me, Tiger, and I'm as flexible as a government-insured zero-down variable rate mortgage. Oh my God, you're so naughty. I love it. <laughs> you know it, slut. We're not leaving without Felipe. Well, then you're not leaving. Oh, fine.
Did we settle on Felipe? Do I have a fever? Why? Let me check. You know, we have a thermometer. Do you have to be so white all the time? Oh, maybe Alex knows. Is she home? Nope. I have not seen her for hours. Does Haley know an Arja barge? Hi, Mom. Hi, honey. Where are you? I'm in the kitchen. Alex? Wait, I think I remember telling her to use something people wouldn't know about her, like her favorite literary character. I'm in! What? What was it? Snoopy. Wow. And that could be your new nickname. Okay. Because we're experienced parents. We have a crib. We have a pediatrician. Our house is baby-proofed. Our house was in architectural digest. Ronaldo, please, you're not helping. They don't know what that is. How can you even... If it helps, I can alert my magician contacts in Vegas. Although they are better at making girls disappear than they are fighting. <laughs> what? Do the thing. Do the cute thing. Dad. Claire. Dad. Mitchell. What are you doing on my phone? You called me, Dad. No, I didn't. I'm shooting a video with Joe. Am I in your kitchen with you? No. I know we're not there yet, but I've been researching annulments. Oh, we are there because you let our child get a mohawk. Oh, sweet. We uh, had a bet. You let him get a mohawk because he won a bet? No, he lost the bet. But Phil! What? I, 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 rather, I had a mohawk. I have a career. Dad, I... Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Clerk, I am trying to fix Gloria's it. talking to me. Some of it's in English. Claire, Claire. Look, look. I fixed Luke's hair. Oh, my God. He looks like Shemp. I'll kill that, Andy. How could he be so irresponsible? I mean, he's a good kid. But to run off with my baby girl after I fell for his aw shucks act? Which is probably not an act, because he's genuinely nice and he thinks shucks is the S-word. Still, I want to kill him! But that'd be robbing my grandchild of probably a really great father! Damn you, Andy Bailey! His last name is Bailey? Oh, my God, she's going to be Haley Bailey. At sea. sea. No, Daddy's lonely. I'm there with you. No, you're not. You're not even close. This can't possibly sound the same to you. Maybe I can help. Daddy is also here at sea. sea. No, that's not even a note. I feel like you're doing it on purpose. That seems a little bit sharp. I'm never sharp. I'm pitch perfect. I'm talking about your tone toward our daughter. I can understand you. You even when you're singing. Hey, yo! How's my beautiful wife? What happened? Why do you look like that? I'm just happy to see you. You look like a crazy person. Dad, what are you doing with your face? Come on. Did anyone else notice that Joe stopped crying? Yeah. Back from the talent show early. Don't ask why. I love it when children have talent. Why are you smiling like that? <gasps> Did something happen to mom? That's crazy. We can just knock it out of the sky. Manny, grab the hose. I'll use this to blind it. My eyes! And just like that, it disappears. In his defense, the water's really cold. Why? Because we closet. I'll have what she's closet. Mama always said life is like box closets. On your mark, get set, closet. Let's get ready to closet! Say hello to my little closet. I know, you're upset because I said that There's you There's no such thing as a born cheerleader. It takes hard work and sacrifice. You know what a human pyramid is without hours of training? Mm -mm. Ten obituaries. Hey, or we could just blow it off, man. No, Gloria, come on, come on, get up, get up, come on, come on, come I... on. Stay up all night, it's in your blood. You come mm. from the land of coffee and cocaine. And to do my nails, the girls need it just for fun. What's fun about a lifetime of gender confusion? I... Don't do this, Jay. As your best friend, I implore you. If we rebuild this castle, we tear down everything we built today. What and what? Where's Alex? I made her a smoothie. Might have made it a little too healthy. Gloria. Howdy, hobby. How about some grub before we turn on the NASCAR? We're here. We're queer. We don't support corporations that contribute to super PACs, which don't support health care coverage for same-sex partners. Oh. I was telling the truth yesterday. I don't care if I lose valedictorian if it'll prove that I really like you. Are, are you serious? Yes. <laughs> Please don't laugh at me. I'm... I'm feeling very exposed with my skinny legs. I feel stuff. Really? Because when we were sick a few weeks ago, you didn't seem to care. I didn't care. Well, she's yeah. not a liar. We did something right. Mm -hmm. Don't you think you should have cared a little bit? Why? You always get better. Well, so far. What do you mean, so far? Um, well, 
Uh, like uh, someday you're not gonna get better? Like you're gonna die? No, 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 no. Not, not for a very, very long time. Then why are we talking about it now? Well, hey, you brought it up. I just... Oh, sorry. Jay. No. Hey, buddy. Hey, hey. It's gonna look even better when it's painted. Oh, the awning's a nice touch. Hey, Jay, is this castle supposed to look like so... It's your... <gasps> oh, oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness, Claire, that's one of mine. Yes, Oh, it that is. looks so good there. Right? I just love all the colors. It makes me feel so happy. Yeah. I call it Rape of the Immigrant. Bye. Bye, Luke. Uh, I lift weights. Hey, what's up? Manny, you and I are going to college. You sure are, buddy. Who cares what that guidance counselor said? I'm dying here trying to hold down two jobs while you enable a once proud man who is clearly having a talent-free breakdown. You know why he reminds you of Van Gogh? Because he's earning nothing. And he's losing his mind. Hey, everybody. Guess who's back? Who? Who's back? Well, I got this from here. So <laughs> what do you think you're doing? What I was born to do. I am a coach, damn it. Oh, God, I'm so sorry. <gasps> that came off so much easier when you did it. God, OK, oh my no, God. it's in here. It's in here. OK, OK. Oh, it's in my shirt. I was gone for 30 God, seconds. Dad. <clears throat> Oh, yeah. That's why I'm here. I already did my required hours. That's a fancy way of saying you're a virgin. Joke all you want, but this looks good on an application to NYU or UCLA or KFC. Hello? Tommy? Tommy? Oh, hey, I'm kind of stuck here. Could you go get a grown-up? Sorry, we can't hear you. Really? With those ears? I'm sorry, that wasn't called for. What do you want, money? I got money. Go ahead, use the credit cards. You'll spend less than my wife. I mean, I'm worried that she's getting a little... There it is again. Just say it, Claire. You like our kids running wild because you're worried they're too much like their namby-pamby dad, Mr. Goody-Goody Mayor of Vanilla Town. Hey. Um, how are you? Not great, but honestly, I don't want to bore you. Oh, uh, well, at least start the story. Okay, um, well, I got back from Portland and Phil was in the bathtub with all the ducks and I just completely lost it. And yes, I've apologized, but he's really not letting go of it this uh, time. I, you know, Mitchell? Who's Mitchell? A magic Mitch. Welder by day, stripper by choice. My unwed sister is seven months pregnant. My mother has some uterine issues, not covered by Medicare. But if you want to make it rain, I will make it. Mitchell, OK, we don't have time for this. You're fine. Everybody freeze! Taekwondo, eyes on those blood bats. Let's burn them down fast. Come on, Mad Skills 87. You're supposed to be on spell interrupt. Do not let those casters get off any more frost traps. Lisa, looks like it's you and me on the lava demon. Hang tight. Powder! <sighs> And I will be getting my coat. Claire, what is going out on? Here as soon as I Luke? I'm just gonna grab my razor scooter and bounce. Happy. No, you know it's no one's birthday. And you came to me? Yeah. You've always had such a strong sense of what's right and wrong, and you always know I what. I have to... a high school boy toy. What? Who? It's Luke's dorky friend, Ruben. Ugh. I feel so ashamed. Oh my god, you should be. Isn't he like eight? Oh, what the hell is that, Dad? I'm playing an accordion. It's supposed to be a rock star. I think you should do like a guitar or something. I only know how to play the accordion. Pick on Mitchell, he's playing a flute. At least I hope he is. I feel like if Andy weren't engaged, we'd have a chance. And if Ruben were just a little bit older and didn't wear prescription shoes. It'd still be gross. I know. What are we gonna do? We should both just end it. I am not killing myself. And when you nag me constantly, it feels like I'm talking to my mother. When I have to nag you, it makes me feel like I am your mother, which could be why it's been a month since we played with each other's pogo sticks. Oh. oh my god! How do you think we feel, Mitchell? I feel like you're up to something, but I don't care. I want a present. I'll take the bike-shaped one. Nice wrapping job, by the way. Ah, uh, wasn't that for Joe? Which is why I've decided to retire. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Wow. Well, maybe retire, the wrong word, more of a transition. So when people ask, Where's Jay Pritchett? You tell him he's transitioning. Mm -hmm. This is Andy and Haley's private business. I think we should be focused on this special night. This special silent night. One and two. No. Silent night. Yeah, I'll give Beth a tour of the house while we get Gloria up to speed. Don't you just love the holidays? Full of yeah. wonder and magic and surprise and... What? Enough, enough. All I wanted was a white Christmas. And instead, I'm back in Colombia. The heat. The betrayal, people stealing songs. This ends now.
Andy, stop whining and be grateful that Haley likes you. She's a Stone Cold Tena, you're a Utah Seven. This cannot be our present. It's your birthday, I'm an omelet. Mm. It's your birthday. I don't know what's I'm happening, but omelet. I love it. It's, it's my birthday. birthday, you're I'm an omelet. What was the bet? Phil, I mean it. Don't say another word. They're gonna figure it out, Tom. How could they They're figure it out? They're gonna figure it out. Phil. We were they... drunk on margaritas and we wanted to find out whose wife would eat the most crickets. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna. After that summer, things got pretty rough. Dad died. Mom started drinking. It's a lot to handle. I love your shirt. Is it new? Oh, I think this shirt's older than you are. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Lily, can I see you in the bedroom, please? Older than I am. Oh, Rob, you're killing me. <laughs> okay, we'll be right back. And enough. You're missing the silver lining here, honey. I lost a bet. So I didn't eat crickets. You ate three. Oh. Lisa had six. Oh. Six? You could have won with four. Baby, baby, I couldn't take that chance. Excuse me, could you take this for us? Um, I guess I have a second. Oh, took a picture of myself. <laughs> oh, and now it's your wallpaper. Uh -huh. You're breaking up with me? This business was my idea. I got you into the farmer's market. I got you into those baskets. You were nothing but a housewife when I found you. I didn't mean that. I've always admired you. Being a housewife is the hardest job on the planet. You're never not at work. It's just, how did we get to this place? Unless there's someone else, isn't there? Vietnamese girls and a man in makeup. When does Bob Hope take the stage? Delightful. You're good to go on the air mattresses. Good luck with the sleepover. Yes, ma'am. We all hate the ducks. We all want them gone. Why do I have to be the bad guy? I don't know. Why am I the pretty one? We all have our thing. Oh, wow. How could I be so blind? Let me guess. Somebody with more experience? Somebody Colombian? Well, you're no picnic either. So who is it? Hmm? Say something! I'd like to toast my dad on his first day of retirement. Congratulations on 42 years in the closet. Business. Son of a... Your husband's outside half naked. There's still time to go downstairs and body shame him if you like. Okay. They're judging me? Felix and Jordan sell fur. Sorry, we couldn't help overhearing you overhearing us. Some friends of ours are breaking up and they need a good divorce lawyer. Do you have a card? We couldn't help overhearing you talking about you overhearing you overhearing you. Are you really doing gay divorces now? We had no idea. I was just overhearing you guys overhearing Good me. Lord. Ra was very supportive. Maybe I just never had the right teacher. <sighs> Am I doing it right? Shh. Uh, sure, yeah, now, okay. Oh, you know what? There's a fun way to open these. I don't know if I've ever taught you. <laughs> Whoopsie daisy. Bon appetit. That time. It could be him. That could be him, you guys. It could be him. Get. That could be him. It could be him. It's not him. <laughs> Is it hideous? It's what hideous? I barely even noticed it. What's challenging is Pam has the same condition. I thought that maybe I could focus if I could get those contraptions in sync. Why did you plug it back in? I'm not leaning. Maybe you're leaning so it looks like I'm leaning. Oh yeah, you're right. Phil! What are you doing? Still searching! Anything suspicious? Say nothing. Okay. Phil? Answer her. You said say nothing. I meant say the word nothing. The word. Nothing! Finally, we found something that worked. For me. Ah! No, what the hell? <laughs> Hey. Oh, Claire. Let's just check Luke's room, and then we can tell Claire we didn't find anything. Okay, there's two ways we can play this. Okay. Claire, there's something we have to tell you. What did we decide to do again? Yeah. 
We're, go we're gonna need a minute. It was my idea, too. I'm the one who set off the smoke alarm. I'm the one who bribed Lily with soda. I'm the one who put a red light bulb in the laundry room to give it a sexy vibe. You've got to stop thinking of me as your perfect little boy. Honey, there's a party upstairs. Party upstairs. Rex, Scooby, Clifford. What are you doing? Trying to figure out his name. What about Dad? Your dad. Nope. Claire, I know why you're always worried. Because you don't know what's going to happen. It's called fear of the future. Or faf. Or fataf. But spoiler alert, it's going to be great. Guys, I have two words for you. Think about time travel. Which is why. Which is why. How you doing? Who's that? Urgh, I'm the pizza monster. Good point. You do have Haley's number, right? From the first time that I saw your face, I knew you could be mine. Ah. Alex Dumphy, would you make me the happiest cat in school and swing by prom with me? Shana, nope. How do you know all this? What are you, some kind of real estate agent? Oh, he's a realtor. There is a difference somehow. Oh, um, Mitchell, we have a problem. No, we don't. I mean, unless you're busy that night. She's a ditzy girl who causes problems for everyone but never realizes it. That doesn't sound very realistic. And I miss her so much. I, I'm gonna see the luckiest man in the world marry the most wonderful woman in the world, and I have nobody. Excuse me, sir. This woman says she's your wife. Never seen her before. But here's someone I do know, my son Mitchell. Mitchell and Dee Dee are great pals. Tell these lovely folks about your mother. She's a scheming dragon woman hell-bent on destroying everyone around her. You're so serious. <laughs> I want to make sure I capture your beauty. Do I see it? I hope you like it. Pepper's parties are as fun as they are confusing. OK, stay with me on this one. Gender blender Broadway brunch. You dress as a Broadway character of the opposite sex, and there's no solid food. It's the perfect party if you're a show queen with a broken jaw. So you think he's the, the they? Oh, come on, Dad. Don't be so naive. We were all 17 once. It's not like we all. To be honest, I don't know why I was so upset. I knew I was supposed to be mad, but I couldn't figure out why, so I just started saying a bunch of stuff. Under my roof? That was weird. In a bed that I paid for? What does that have to do with anything? With your grandfather watching? Sweet home Alabama, eyes and hair of gorgeous blue. Well, why don't I stop talking about how good it is here and just bring you some? <laughs> OK, bye-bye. <laughs> We need to pick up a wheel of Arizona spicy sheep cheese. Couldn't you just say goodbye? Claire, the sign says no loud noises. You'll scare David Blaine. Hey, Grams. How's, how's the coma? Mm. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Are, are you trying to say something? Oh, ow. Ow, the, Grams. Ow, that hurts. Let, let go. Gram, let, let go. Let go, Grams. Let go, Grams. What the hell let... are you telling her? <laughs> This is Sean, and I want to get this right. Beautiful African name, Sean By the way. I said, by the way. Oh. It was hard for uh, us to hear, but in the spirit of tolerance, uh, we accepted the fact that a nine-year-old might not want to fall asleep under the watchful eyes of her half-naked fathers. You're using me as a therapy dog. That's ridiculous. Am I? Well. What about what Luke's doing? We just dealt with him and Haley. You are the only one who really cares about me. That's it. I'm going back to school. I will drive you, sweetie. Alex, no, stop. Stay. How do you ask a human not to go again? 
Hey. Hey. What's with the suit? Me? Why are you dressed like Nicki Minaj? You didn't want me? This isn't about you, honey. I think Daddy's ramping up to something. Anywho, there's a football player on the team who needs a place to stay until the end of football. No. No, no, no. Would you let me finish? Okay, fine. Go ahead. Season. I actually have some exercises that can help you. Like, Betty bought a bit of butter, but found the butter bitter. Betty bought a bit of booty, but the booty bitter. Dwight Bullock? I have to arrest you. You've been a bad boy. <laughs> Joe's doctor gave me some speech exercises to help me speak more clearly. The problem is I fear I have forgotten how I used to talk. Well, now you're the one who's wet. Not really. Most of it's on the floor. <laughs> Joe, short for Joseph. J, short for Jesus. It's the only way it makes sense. But he's the child. You're overthinking it. Ah! I'm not a real beaver, it's me, Dad. Excuse me, hi. Have you seen a little brat about this tall, dressed as Darth Vader, throws eggs, laughs like this? <laughs> Yo, looks like everyone made it. But where's Vlad? The exchange student from Latvia? I haven't seen him. I'd love to catch up with that dreamboat. So much has happened since high school. <laughs> alcoholism. And then I have my study where I could close the door and have a glass of scotch, and now it's Joe's room, and that's fantastic. But this is the only place I have left that I don't have to share with my family. Uh, and I want to leave you <laughs> with this one last thing. Do not go gentle. Do not go gentle into that good night. Rage! Rage! Against the dying of the light. This reminds me of the time I walked in on you watching Top Gun. I oh, watch out, watch out. I think Mitchell is looking at us. Yeah, I thought I cooled his suspicions this morning. Laugh and disperse. <laughs> <laughs> God, I'm so conflicted. A gay kid is now bullying football players, which I guess you know, seems like progress, but the wrong kind of progress. Would you like I... a... Ah! In my defense, Bruschetta mostly ends up on the floor anyway. Cam? I think you might be more worried about this prank than you need to be. Well, I just don't understand why they want to prank me. I thought they liked me. Oh, of course they like you. You can't prank someone you don't like. That's that's just assault. What's wrong with you? Pick it up. Yeah, let's do it. Let's pick it up. What <laughs> the hell's the matter with you? Why are you making those sounds? I don't think that's... I think what Phil's trying to say is that he and I haven't had a boy's night in a good while. I mean, wouldn't it be nice to just hang out together? Just you and me. What do you say, buddy? What? Excuse me? I know how hard it is to be a gay teen. And in high school, I only had one friend. Really? What was Oscar Wilde like? You're lashing out. Because you're angry and you're insecure and you just want everyone else to feel as bad as you do. Maybe, but come on. It must have been easier for you looking like Michael Fassbender. No, I do not look like my, you think I look like Michael Fassbender? Yeah, if you were older and shorter and played by Kathy Griffin. I just wanted to read my book. Uh, how am I saying it wrong? His name is Keith. No. Keith. It couldn't be simpler. K-E-I-F-T-H, Keith. You know, we don't talk in my family. We riff. We do bits. You know how my dad told me my grandmother died in a knock-knock joke? Oh, don't cry. Crying's worse than sweating. Oh, <laughs> now I'm crying, too. <laughs> Maybe we can smile our way out of it. <laughs> and plus, he walks in here. I lose it. I don't want Lily to see that. Oh, she's not here. She has that sleepover, and she already left. Wow. This is a great workout. Oh, no! Sorry, sorry. You're funny. <laughs> I did not expect that from a seismologist. Hmm. Which, by the way, how did you get into that? Oh, um, it's just always come easy for me. You know, I look at people and I just instinctively know their size. People are like, oh, I'm a four, and I'm like, oh, you fooling girl, you a ten. Hey, I'm curious <laughs> that napkin you asked for. Oh, thanks. Haha, <laughs> fooled you. I was just joking about clothing stuff. The real reason why I got into studying earthquakes is because I love nature. And I keep telling you, but it's like you're not hearing me. I'm not. Wait, don't talk yet. <laughs>
Go now, quick. Stop acting like I'm someone I'm not. Stop telling me how great I am when it's not true. Don't you see how much pressure that is? Luke, don't you walk away from me? I guess that would explain the ornithology interest, too, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Miss, could I have another? Um, yeah, 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 yeah. Angels have always been cool, but not as cool as birds. I love birds. Mm. Hope you have fun here while I'm shoveling poo in some underground poo shoveling place. Well, why'd you even come here if you're so sure you can't get in? I don't know. Maybe because this is the one place we might both get in. That might make this whole thing a little less scary. Well, that's the only reason I applied, too. Then why are we fighting? I don't know. So we still going to the party? Yeah, I'll put on a hat. That was Joe's school. He's in trouble. We need to go meet with the teacher. What the hell did he do? He robbed a bank and took 18 hostages. How would I know? Let's go. Sammy, tell your gunkles hello like a tacha. Enchante. What am I looking at here? I'm raising them gay. Hmm? Tell Uncle Mitchell what you think about those pants. Tragic. Oh, it's sticking. And? We also really do have a reservation at that really nice place down the street, so we should probably get your check. Excuse me, could we get the check? But are you really dressed? Cameron Mitchell, what a pleasant surprise. Sal, you OK? You seem not yourself. Yeah, I feel like you used to blink. I took your advice, called Werner. I told him I wasn't going to settle. How did that, how, how did that go? I mean, I get why you two idiots settle. It's the best you're gonna do right here. You're perfectly matched. Oh, <sighs> well, it's kind of sweet when you look at it that way. Yeah, we, we are very lucky. Happy Valentine's Day. Yeah, it's not busy. Shut up. Dad, I think something's wrong with the dryer. But I, I fixed it. I fixed it good. I'll be right there. Hurry, I think it's leaving. I'm up here. Ay, Dios mío, your time was too short. I'm on the roof. Ah. But I do want you to feel like you have a voice in this. So not only is my office door always open to you, I've actually had it removed. Watch. Is that it? I'm confused because I'm not mechanically inclined. Hardy, har, har. No, I just need to make a little adjustment. Watch out! Oh, oh my God! Oh! oh. Are you okay? Oh. oh! This little guy in his 40s here every Friday always has a super complicated drink order. Oh. Hey, Alex, I'll have a 20 ounce ice skinny hazelnut macchiato, sugar free syrup, double shot of espresso, light ice, not no ice, no whip. Who are you texting? Nah, no one. I'm just reading my horoscope. Liar, why would anyone read their horoscope so late in the day everything's already happened? The widow Dubois slumps in a chair emotional. Ugh, ma chérie, your papa will be devastated to hear you say such insensitive things. So the red pins on this map mark all the locations of closets that were made with the toxic wood. Okay, and we have recalled nine out of 10 of the contaminated closets, so we only need to track down one more. And since you didn't ask, the green pins are all the addresses of potential fathers of mine. Stop! Imposter! <gasps> oh, close your door, man. We're in pursuit. Okay, Thank okay, you. Okay. My dad didn't know anything. That was just a big act for his kid. Yeah, I know. I was playing along. The Save it, okay? Somewhere. One of these green pins is very disappointed. Hey, kiddo, why is your hand wet? It's not, it's sweaty. I went to the gym this morning, Fridays I do legs and hands. Claire, here's the water you asked Thank for. Thank you. <laughs> the teeth just fell out. <laughs> I knew Mitchell was lying. I was just giving him the opportunity to come clean. I had discovered the urn was empty. She's so lucky. He's always gonna be her little boy. Mom, you're projecting on these mannequins. For all we know, he's a little person, and that's his wife who's evolved enough to see how big he is on the inside. I'm sure you're wondering why I want these ashes. Not really, but I'm gonna need the urn back. Gonna turn it into a lamp. Hello, Mitchell. Oh, God! <gasps> oh, well, cheers. Cuidado. Mm -hmm. Okay. What happened? Did we land? Cam, listen to me, listen to me, listen to me. 
if we're gonna have any chance of getting to Dallas and then surviving there, we are going to need hats. 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 Excuse me, sir. Sir, sir, are you the proprietor of this haberdashery? Can you point me in the direction of your finest sports caps? What team? Gay, I'm not sure why that's relevant. Oh, okay. Why would they want you, honey? It's not all about grades. I mean, you were involved in, in... Yay! Yeah! Did you talk to them? I'm sorry, what? Show me your tongue. I don't know what that would prove. This kind of seems like an embarrassing family moment. I'm on it. <laughs> Blue! You know what? I think I am going to get these. No, Mitchell, mm -hmm. we can't. Oh, look, little girl's hats. Oh. We should get one for Linda. Who? Um, our daughter. Are you harmless? Please don't, don't. He kissed me. You kissed my mom? You kissed yeah. my wife? I'm just going to pull in here. 12 bucks? No wonder the middle class is so angry. Mitchell, why do you have 32 written on your arm? I have no idea. Maybe it's some sort of code, or maybe it's my age. Do I look 32 to you? Tell me the truth. No, you might know don't. Well, if we wrote it down, it must be something important. Hey, we should write down other stuff that seems important so we don't forget. Yeah, okay. Um, um well, hats. Hats, obviously. obviously. Okay. Uh, what else? I feel like there was, um... A number. There was not 32. 32. Mm -hmm. You're hearing that right? Please yeah. report to gate 32 immediately. Are we in trouble? I don't know. He sounds mad. He does. Haley, I'm 45 years old. I, I don't want to just date and see where things go. That's not where I am in my life. What are you saying? I think we're both saying it. No, 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 don't. Oh, God. Oh! Knock it off! Ow! Okay, you're gonna suck it up, you're gonna pull your act together, and you're coming with me to gate 3232. That can't be right. You're wearing a cowboy hat. So are you. What is this? I don't think we're supposed to have that. So it appears I've gotten a piercing. What? Mm -hmm. Connect the dots, you dummy! I'm wearing real loose clothes. I need money real bad. My hair is lustrous like a lion's mane. You're in love? No, the opposite. I'm pregnant. OK. Oh, God. The family didn't want me to get back together with Bo on account of he's six parts Chicopee and married. But I did it anyway. And now he's in county for punching a police horse in the face. Well, I think the choice is clear. Joe. Tibor. Tibor? I like his energy. He doesn't have any. It's funny. We've only been volunteering here at the Women's March for an hour. Five minutes. But it already feels like I'm part of something big, something really special. Would you snap a picture? So you can prove you were here, get school credit, and be home faster than the ink dries on that poster you just misspelled? Women untie? Still works. Phil, Phil, we have a problem. Oh, we? You're hired. Great, let's get this baby off the ground. I'm Joey, by the way. Hi. Thank you. <laughs> I'm Haley. <laughs> what? She's awesome, it's confusing. Are you trying to make me fail? Mind your own business. I would love to. But now I'm wondering if all that gasping is about something I've already read or something coming up. I'm on page 312. Don't tell me that. Now I know there's a gasp coming in 20 pages. Guess who I found driving through the neighborhood who insisted on stopping over to say hi with his new wife and her kids? It was me, Dylan, you know, from before. I I I'm as upset as you are, but since when did anything work out the way we planned? We didn't plan on having Haley. We didn't plan on having Alex. We did plan on having Luke, but we didn't plan on having Luke. Thank you. Have a good day at school, sweetie. Bye, sweetie. It's fourth grade. We're all just treading water. What is it? Uh, well, it's, it's from the principal's office. Is she in trouble? No. She's smart. She is? That's what it says. Hi, sir. No, that's just a buoy. <gasps> a boy? No, a buoy. A... Oh, my captain, it's stuck in the... Oh! Ah! The sun! Ah! Turn around. Me. Every now and then I get a little bit tired of listening to the sound of my tears. Turn around, bright eyes. Who? Done. Just, just so you know, plenty of people find me very attractive, okay? Including my amazing husband, who is no slouch himself. Hi. You sell moo-moos? The only reason I went to that wedding was because of the damn pork! 
Is this going to be the only thing you guys remember about me? Does this have something to do with Hugh Duncan dying and all those Facebook tributes? No! That was a clinic. Yeah, we are parenting at the highest possible level. Highest possible level. You fools! Ow! Paper cut, of course, today. Seriously? This is part of the underwear prophecy? Are you being a little bit mad? Phil? No, I'm deflecting. I feel the sickening threat of brutal honesty, and I'm wildly uncomfortable. Okay, well, here goes. We think it's great that you adopted Lionel, but... <gasps> okay, a little early for that reaction. I haven't even gotten to say, stop imposing your fancy ways on that poor child and hit it. <gasps> Never been much for confrontation. You weren't engaged to a woman six months in law school because you were good at dropping the hammer. Didn't you guys get a cat together? Okay, you know, y yes, you're fired. Okay, you're an incompetent man, Diva. The only thing you've ever built is a closet, i.e. a box of air. So get out and don't let the door hit you on your ample behind. Nicely done. Maybe an unnecessary shot at closets, particularly from someone who was in one for 22 years, but... Mm. You're home early. I was into this awesome girl, Abby, from the club, and tonight we are going to take things to the next level, which is, you know, sex. Always classy to name it. All right. Ah. Looks good. You know, I helped build that. I, I feel like a real construction guy. I kind of wish a woman would walk by so I could objectify her. It, it's Phil. Come in! Phil Dunphy. Kid! Hey. The dress is in the back over there. Oh, great. I'll hide it in the back of that time machine. You, uh... You got a big wrestling match coming up? La dweez up is on the doy. Skididdle dee da dee da dee doo. Bow, bam, chow, cha cha cha. Dad, what is wrong with her? I challenged her to get to 100,000 steps in a week. That's so easy. easy. Without shopping. I get, I get the challenge. No. She's 1,000 steps from glory. Like the rest of you, she was motivated by my stingy praise. As I look around the room, I see nothing but winners, and I couldn't be prouder. To us, everyone here is a winner. Every week, Scott Hunter, the host of I Beg Your Garden, selects an unsuspecting couple at a home store. Yeah, he taps them on the shoulder and says, I beg your garden. What? Oh, my God, I can't believe it! That's how it goes every time. <laughs> every time. Harry was just sitting there by himself because everybody's always afraid to talk to the prettiest girl, except this guy. It's all about confidence. Excuse me, but... <clears throat> Excuse me, Mr. Bradshaw. What, what is all this? Go up the next aisle. Okay. Oh, it's it's not you personally. No, 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 it is me. I'm a distraction. Everyone wants to say hi, or they want to take a picture, they want to sleep with me. They sure do. Shut her down, Marie. And it's a nightmare. It's beginning to affect my creativity. The last song I wrote was about my helicopter. I was too ashamed to release it. I had to sell it to Qantas for a million dollars. Manny has been bringing his teachers home since he was a little kid. His ninth birthday party turned into a PTA meeting. Why are you hanging out in the aisles of the home store? I work here. Oh. You do? Yeah. Oh. Hey, but if you did, still have, have a show. show. Uh -huh. Would you pick us? Um. It costs cost you nothing, nothing to say yes. yes. Oh my god, we agreed again. Aww. Aww. Mrs. Graham's car is on its way. You have five minutes to convince her that this house is fine. I feel this wall feel. No, I am done with this nonsense. I can't believe I'm hearing this from a person that believes in magic. I'm not the one who told you this, but magic isn't actually magic. That didn't come from your ear. What? How? You're with them. Claire, this is the first we're hearing about your she shed. Oh, then I've got something for you right here. She's got a gun! It's a letter, Lisa. Now get out there and take what is ours. And have fun. <laughs> the therapy no. 
<laughs> no, 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 no. That was extraordinary. I have never seen anything like that. He doesn't need me. Here, have a hard candy and a good life. Wait, wait, wait. He's done? No, no. Okay, I, ha I have been coming here for 10 years, and I am just barely scratching the surface. Yeah, you call him extraordinary. Meanwhile, I've been pouring out my soul to you every week, and I get, boop, nothing. And they are both marked L. And L is for, L is for large. <laughs> Hilarious. I'm thinking I've been wearing two left socks. <laughs> I'm adorable. Can you hang on a second? Hello? Claire, everything is okay, but I am taking Phil to the hospital. He's dead! I was just resting my eyes! We have to get this guy prepped for his gallbladder surgery. That means they're gonna shave me. Should we be worried that those could be his last words? I got this. Phil, we love you. I love you, too. Yeah. They're gonna shave me. Well, we tried. Apparently, Joe shared the uplifting news that his friends could die at any minute. I took it a week ago, and I've been too scared to look at the results. Oh, honey, I'm, I'm so sorry you've been going through this by yourself. Hey, hey, well, let's look at the results together, okay? Really? Yeah. <sighs> okay, here goes. Oh, thank God. You're okay. No, my Etsy order shipped, but... So we discovered our dad made a series of videos through the years. Every time he was in danger, he made a goodbye video for us. It turns out he's had the same haircut for a really long time. Hey kids, um, I've been trapped in this porta potty for some time now, and as, as you can see by the, the curling edges of my mustache, the uh, the chemical fumes are strong. He must have drank it after we went to bed. Who does that? Just drink somebody's most expensive bottle of wine without asking? Okay, it's a hate crime. How is it a hate crime? Because I hate him. Uh, I can't. I can't it's, it's almost gone. But you know, I've only ever considered opening that twice. Once early on election night, and then when we thought La La Land won Best Picture. I know it's been a rough year. Hello. Sorry, hello, doctor. Would you like down sit? What? This might sound crazy, but I'm going to marry you. What? I want to turn NERP into the next Disney Facebook Tesla Botox. It's a world changer. It's a roadmap to the future. That was a question. There is a theory that suggests the universe is so large that everything that can happen is happening all the time. Do you smoke weed? I can't believe this is happening again! Again? Oh. We shall have gotten arrested! Mom, where are you? I made you a valet. Okay, what kind of freak show goes on here when I'm not around? Did she tell him? No, oh, it's sometimes it's more exciting to be with someone that already knows what you want without you telling them. Got it. Hey! <laughs> I know, I said I was only getting tulips for the party, but I splurged and I got orchids. Hey, I wanted the party to be special too, and in my defense, I didn't know about the orchids. Uh, I got a piano! Really? Where? Then again, for a while now, when I've been telling my friends that I was struggling, they'd give me that look. The one that's mostly sympathetic, with just a touch of enjoying my pain. So, today, I get the other look. The one that's mostly, I'm so happy for you, with just a hint of, I am racked with jealousy. And who is this? I always assumed I was your sexiest Latin friend. <laughs> this is Gloria, Gloria Ronaldo. Bolivian? Guatemalan, Venezuelan. Colombian. Mm hmm Not sure what this is. Um, so what are you doing in town? Oh, just picking up some wine for a party I'm catering oh. at Oprah Winfrey's. What? Stop it! Oh, what, is that a big deal? Don't you be coy. You know the power dynamic just shifted between us. Footprints are in a really weird pattern. Why do these steps feel so familiar? Camera. Can you believe this? We're going to a party at Oprah's. What if we become friends with her? What if we get our own TV show? Who's gonna pick up Joe from school? Gloria, we'll have drivers. And then forward, forward again, and then, then did a little spin. Yeah, yep, that was it. And then it came back at us, and okay. we were like, right, left, right, right, body roll, and stuff. And then it was just gone. What the hell was that? Hold up. This is monogrammed. M-O? You went to Michelle Obama's without me? You went to Oprah Winfrey's without me? You shamed me into coming here, only to leave me soaking in a, in a bowl of trauma soup? Look at you, you even have a smart watch. Yeah, the damn thing tells me when to stand up, when to breathe. Your body mass index is... Nobody asked! Now take a breath and let those feelings pass like clouds in the sky. 
tension is melting away, that's it. Live in this moment of serenity and stillness. We're so accustomed to go. Why would you do that? My hair is still developing. Nice try, Phil. <laughs> <laughs> honey. Oh, hey, honey. How are you? I'm so sorry. I have to take this. Oh, boy. Hello, Robert. Good. You're home. One second. Happy, you look great in that new shirt. So handsome. Hey, Gloria. Oh. I thought you were money. Good, you're caught up now. I don't even know how to react. So my whole childhood was a lie. I thought Javier was my dad. Now he's just some stranger who gave me baths. Oh, Cam, I hate to think of you living all alone in that tiny apartment with a broken ankle. <gasps> and on the same day, she's emailing you. It's too soon to move in with <sighs> someone. I strongly discourage it. Which is exactly why I did it. And because, and because we were in love. So are in much. love, yes. Oh, my God. Mitchell. She's everywhere. She is. Cam. Yeah. I'm scared. You still got it. And the thing I was worried last night when you kept trying to turn on your phone flashlight and ended up taking 30 pictures of your angry face. Escape room, what is that? Oh, it's a themed room that they lock you in and then you have to solve puzzles and clues to, um, you know, escape. Or they cut off your finger. What? No, it's just for fun. Yeah. Oh, but then that lowers the stakes. She doesn't remember I'm gay. Yeah, no, I know. I was here for the whole explanation. This means I get to come out to her again. It was a disaster the first time. I was, I was so wishy-washy about the whole thing that when, when I finally said, I, I think I might be gay, she said, ew. Well, are you sure she didn't mean, ooh? Enough about me. Um, I love your blazer. Do you have a corgi like the queen? Crazy times in London, am I right? I hear that your uh, bridge is falling down, falling down. Oh. Becky, hi. You remember when you came to see me ice dance and you said that I looked like a little sissy? Well, oh, daddy. Um, he is a professor and an astrophysicist. He's a, a legit genius. Haley, I came as soon as I heard. Actually, that's not true. I stopped for tacos. What about you? Oh, God, this is happening. Um, I, I, um, I, uh, so Spit I... Spit it out. Uh, I'm, I'm not here to take anything from you. I'm here to be my true self. Oh, my God's true self. It's Aunt Becky. I am... A lawyer. A lawyer? Ew. I'm sorry, we thought that you were here to just you know, get information. Get out of here! Dad, if you would just let me see. Who do you think you are marching in here like a bunch of hot shots? And why is nobody wearing socks? Whoa, lower the BP, OG. We're actually trying to do you a favor. Okay. I think you have this twisted. This company has been around since before you all were born, except for maybe him. How is he part of this? This guy? That's our over 40 diversity hire. Oh my gosh, hey, it's going great over there, huh? What's this, are these kids in trouble? That, uh, Scary ogre teeth, where'd you get those? I'm guessing my birth parents. I'm so sorry. Why can't I just shut up? Sorry, was I going on too long? I didn't. <sighs> Thanks. Anytime. Manny, Manny, this is kidnapping. I lied. I'm not married anymore. My wife left me for her ex-husband. I'm a divorcee. Why are you telling me this? Because I'm back in town, I'm going to nursing school, and we might run into each other. I don't want to spend the rest of my life pretending my wife is in the bathroom. Oh, look at her. Mm -mm. Yeah, you can't really make her out, but it captures her wild spirit. Yes. <laughs> is it me or is Manny dating Bigfoot? Can we go? Are we waiting for cake? Or... Is it a birthday? Should I make a toast? toast? No. You know what? We're going to make sure that sketch artist sees the best possible version of you. Let's get those apples a shine. Okay, okay, stop it. Don't. Okay, your face gets weird when you make that O sound, so avoid that. Are you serious? The defendant runs the Orange County Oceanic and Orthological Organization. No more ping pong tables, squirt guns. The only thing we couldn't find was that giant... Break time, bitches! So listen, this is a big campus. Maybe we could both be here if we promise to stay out of each other's way. 
but I'd hate to step on your toes. No, no, you want it. I would hate to stop you from doing something you're so good at. I guess I could think about it. And now maybe you'll have some respect for my investigative skills. It was a pretty simple case because, as I've said, everyone has something to hide. Everyone. Everyone. Get away from that door! Oh, hey, Mr. Dumpy. Oh, oh, you broke my heart. You can play with Dev on me some. Uh, you can watch your truck videos. Hey, don't take your eyes off of him. So just to be clear, I don't get any childhood. Have a seat. You know what? Standing's fine. Listen, uh, Arvin's here. He flew back from Switzerland to surprise Haley. Wow, I'm up against another grand gesture. What's he dressed as? Nothing, just, just himself. <laughs> I like my chances. Sherry, you cannot stay here. What? Why? Because you're driving me crazy. But I thought you liked me. What can I say, kid? She's rough. Let me get your bag. Hey, I'm back. Guess what? All that calligraphy I've done for the dean paid off. He said you could stay with me. Your mom just told me she hates me. Mom, why would you say that? And sin! Look, I know that your mother and I had our differences, but she was a good woman. Yeah. She, um... Uh, yeah, she had great legs. I remember once Mom told me that I ate ice cream like a prostitute. <gasps> okay, very funny. Who did this? Santa Maria, Madre de Dios, ruega por nosotros pecadores. Santa Maria, Madre de Dios, ruega por nosotros pecadores. I, uh... I told her everything's gonna be all right, and then I stagger back to my car, and I start crying. Oh and you know who was there waiting for me? Well, if it's not Didi, it's kind of a touching but pointless story. It was Didi. Speaking of that, I'm thinking about dropping history. How come? It's not really exciting me. Plus, we've got this huge paper due today that I haven't quite finished starting. Thank you. And now we'd like to take a moment to remember our beloved lunch lady, Mrs. Penny Miller. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe you did that. That was amazing. Oh, stop it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa! No! Oh, God. Oh. Did we learn nothing from the glove? But if I can't remember the lyrics, that means I've lost complete touch with my roots. How could I let this happen? Don't be so hard on yourself. I'm not. This is mostly your doing. Should have seen that coming. You, you have shamed the country boy out of me. You roll your eyes when I say y'all or fixin'. You made me take down our clothesline. Just ask what we put it in the backyard. You know what I have to do. Relearn the lyrics? Get a chicken. It was not easy sharing a room with a genius. She was always up reading and calculating, but she also inspired me. When I turned 21, I said, Haley, time to be your own woman. And I moved into the basement. Let's get this party started, rookie. OK, they won't start unless you use the whistle. Whistle! Whistle! OK, Dylan, let's get you changed and lose the hat. It's rude to block people's views where we'll be spending our afternoon at an adult theater. Huh. I mean, we all knew there was going to be a third one, right? Um, can I just say, I am so comfortable with your sexuality. Can I just say that your comfort with my sexuality has made me more comfortable with my sexuality? Can I just say that if I had my gun in my purse, I would shoot myself? Call me to your left. <laughs> Come to your right. Stop dragging, Petkowski. They're coming after your sweetheart. You know what they did to Poland. Boy, I want to stop this, but there's nothing in the guidelines about communists. What about Lily's school? They have schools in Grasshopper. Do they? Plus, Lily has so many friends here. Does she? Did I hear my name? What are you two Yentas gabbing about? We were just talking about moving to Grandma and Grandpa's farm in, in, in the heart of Tornado Alley. Oh, Cam, Cam? Look, she's clearly terrified. Yeah, well, don't worry, sweetie, because it's already been determined we're staying here forever because other daddy is planting dead Nana in the backyard. I'm out. Oh, my God! 
Oh, uh, uh, oh my god. I'm not cut out to be a mother. Then again, a real baby is easier than a doll, right? <laughs> like, a real baby would let you know if it was on fire. What is wrong with me? Maybe Dr. Johnson is right. Maybe I don't have what it takes to live on Mars. <laughs> stop! Stop! It's not you. After I solved the puzzle, I wanted to make sure you couldn't, so I broke a few pieces, glued some others together. It can't be solved. Uh, I'm uh, that uh, puzzle! Uh, I'm uh, in uh, uh, Wait. Well, this can't be right. This itinerary says we're on four flights with three layovers. Oh, yeah. Um, remember how I found that amazing airline deal online? Yeah, but two of these layovers are six hours each. Yes, but the third one's only 12 minutes. But it's at O'Hare. Honey, we'll have to sprint from one end of the airport to the other. It'll all be worth it when we wake up on December 27th in Bermuda, where the forecast predicts hot fog. Can we go look at phones after this? No, Lily, you are not getting a cell phone for Christmas. They're expensive and you haven't proven yourself responsible enough to own one yet. Uh, I was responsible enough to come to a foreign country and build a life with two strangers. Okay, you use that one to get a later bedtime, all right? Listen to this part. Soon a baby as cute as us will spring forth from Haley's uterus. Well, we got what we need. I'm glad someone's getting what they want this year. You know what? Here, take my phone. If you could get through a day without losing it, it's yours. We have an announcement. Dylan and I are having a baby. Are they smiling? Deck the halls with boughs of holly. Fa la 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 la. Tis the season to be jolly. Fa la 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 la. Don we now our gay apparel. Fa la 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 la. Did we leave the kids at Claire's house? Fa la 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 la. Revenue. I can't hear you. <clears throat> Volume up, Dad. And our first year alone. What the hell? So oh, great that you're out. It must have been so lonely in there. Well. There was some companionship. <laughs> I dabbled in lesbianism. Oh. Didn't hate it. But there was just too much talking afterwards. Mm. Whenever I get tired of standing, all I have to do, press this button, a spring-loaded leg jets out to provide me with a comfy seat. Hey! Have your stupid meeting. I'm out of here. Margaret, I'm going to the park across the street. I need to walk. I gestured you over here because we need to talk about Lily. Yes, I puzzled that out. Also, you don't need to whisper. Watch. Honey, your father and I may get divorced because he's thinking about becoming a woman. That explains a lot. I'm in between songs. Okay. Uh, Hello, Phil. I'm preparing a plate for Adiva. Is everything okay? Uh, actually, no. I lost my temper with Pepper when he told me he wanted to see more houses, and I've been calling to apologize, but... He's not picking up. How did you know? It seemed the only possible conclusion to your sentence. You're trying to protect your daughter from a guy like me, but I haven't been a guy like me for a long time. Bend for me. It's hard, Dylan. I have been a mama bear for so long. No, your elbow. Oh. It's all happening so fast. But it is happening. I'm about to be the father to your grandbabies. You chowed a little? I meant emotionally. We'll start with the camera coming down the walk. You open the door, say welcome to 15683 Canyon Ridge Drive, a six bedroom, seven bathroom, 8,600 square foot home in the prestigious 902 and 2 zip code. You got it? 15683, 15683, I got it. Good, let's try one. Here we go, ready? And action. One, five, six, eight, three. Cut. Moving on. Hey, we tried. That one time. Hey, girl, hey. Hey, so, sweetie, Daddy and I were wondering if now that you're wearing a training bra, if you had any other questions about your changing body. Can we just not? Sounds good. Yeah, perfect. Take a walk through. Does the flow make sense? Well, um, <clears throat> I would get out of the shower and throw my clothes in the hamper here, pick out an outfit, and then get dressed right here. You just threw your clothes in the fireplace and got dressed in front of the picture window. Well, and best of all, the entire house is fully automated. You can turn on the gorgeous fountains right from your phone. Shoot, they're not working. 
Hey, I can feel my toe. Hey, Mom, is this divider a little too high? No, no, it's supposed to be that way. That way, if one twin wants to visit the other, he can just go, a do 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 hi. didn't fill the order perfectly, so check the pizzas, make sure they didn't shift. Oh, Haley, I'm sure you're worrying about nothing. Oh, 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 oh. Cal Shop TV viewers, I have a very special treat for you. Joining me is Jay Pritchett with the most exciting new product, right, Jay? I'm Jay. I'm beat. Can you turn off the light? Yeah, just give me a second. Five, four, Three, two, one. You missed our anniversary. Thank you, Janet from Pomona. And to your little Pomeranian, Tony, I'd just like to say... Dylan Stardust Marshall, will you... Oh, going over. Okay, okay. I'm fine, I'm fine. It's okay. Will you marry me? Oh, my God. This is exactly how I imagined it. Who's a goody woody boy? Who's a seepy boy? I never thought I'd say this, but I miss Jay's toxic masculinity. Um, I just want to say that most of you are very important to us. But the wedding's off, and thanks for coming. What? You're kidding me! This is an outrage. I will never forgive you. Perhaps the two of you would like to sing a song? Choices. Impossible. Impossible. Choices. Impossible. Choices. many voices. I tried to pretend I was a 3D cutout of myself to avoid talking to him. But you know what? Today I want to talk to him. I think I'll let old Skip know I have a daughter graduating from Caltech. No, honey, we are not the kind of parents who make ourselves look good by bragging about our kids. Then why did we even have them, Claire? Are we really not going to crow about it when one of our kids finally does something we can be proud of? I love you both very much. I'm comfortable being the hot one. Wow, it's wild like, where all these kids are going to end up, right? I mean, there's so many great schools. In fact, our... Oh, is something wrong? Our daughter joined ISIS. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm going to learn how to speak Spanish. Excelente. I, I haven't started yet. Uh, get out. Gucci baby sneakers. <laughs> They're adorable. Yeah. Our baby's going to be so hot. What you expect? He's 20 years old. He proposed in front of his family at a pretend restaurant. Whatever happened to yes and? Jay, I've tried everything. Please say something to him that will make him feel better. Fine. Kid, let it go. It was four days ago. Right, let's make a wish. I wish I were dead. Listen, I want to thank my family for being my biggest cheerleaders. Uh, I love you too, honey. No, Haley's going into labor. We've got to get her to the hospital. I tried honey. to hold it. I'm sorry. Oh, my God. I'm so sorry, everyone. Convenient. Okay? No. Everything's amazing. Why would you say it that way? Students, hi. When you hear your name, please proceed to the stage and grab your diploma. Nelly Abershami, Allison Acosta, Frida Alfrey, Scott the Skunk, Albanese, Kalanick, Richard Thompson Allen, Laveria Amenu, Larry Anaconda, Darla Arleto, Daniel Day. Miano fue hermoso. My year was beautiful. Mm. Año means year. Ano means anus. It still works. Hey, everybody. <gasps> oh, where are the babies? I want to see them. There's no easy way to say this. Mitch and Kim have a whole thing they want to do. Oh, oh, God, it's worse than I thought. <laughs> A rage bat and a little machine that's supposed to trick my nose into calming me down. Why does everyone think I'm so tense? You bet through your night guard. You're squeezing me too hard. And last week you made the pharmacist cry. That's because he wouldn't sell me any more Sudafed. The entire family was sick. I was not cooking meth. You know what? I don't even want cake. I really don't appreciate being criticized like this, especially on my birthday. I would have called... But first, I did a weird thing to my hands. They froze in a permanent hang, loose signs. People keep calling me dude. Oh, what are you doing, Hope? Well, it was a disaster. Uh -huh. George headbutted me and gave me this black eye. Oh. And Dylan read that skin-to-skin -skin contact is good for baby bonding and wound up with a massive sunburn. Can you tell 
<gasps> oh, plus we forgot the diaper bag, so we had to use fast food wrappers that we found in Dylan's van. In it's the sha -la 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 -la. What are you doing? Hey! Power ballad shallow. You know, she didn't even seem happy to see me. She just wanted me to get some soup. Plus, mom said she was sick, but she was wearing that stuff that makes her look like a prostitute. Eyeliner? Exactly. Hmm. You know, mom did mention some big interview coming up. Did she get rid of us if we didn't make her look bad? Oh. Alex, meet us at home as soon as you get out of that fireplace. Theo! Theo, where are you? I want to show you how Levy's hair and blood got on my car. I can hear the rustling in the bushes. <laughs> Why would a sheep be here? Where am I going to get that kind of money? Oh! 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 Oh, I trip! Someone call a lawyer! Oh. Is this your ring? It is! <laughs> is this your sock? It is. Oh, whoa. oh. <laughs> Is this your card? I don't remember. Why doesn't she know she deserves better? I think I have some old cheese puffs in my room. <laughs> Damn it! How'd you get all the way across town? I'm coming, baby! I'm coming! Hey, J. How you doing? Great. I'm so scared. Ah. Don't patronize me. You don't think I can tell when you're faking it. Oh, Phil. Mmm, so good. I know you hated my gumbo. Did I scare you? You did this? Yep. How long have you played? 11 this months, thing? two weeks, and three days ago, I gave birth to Ida May Man because Ida May Man. Oh, don't you dare do wordplay, Phil. Sorry. I was having so much fun. What? I was wondering what we were going to do for the next 30 years of our lives without the kids in the house. And now I know. You're getting twisted. I like it. And just remember, this is for our daughter. Game on. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Game on. What do you mean, game on? It's, it's game over. Nope. Watch your back, buddy. This is going to be so much fun. Can't we just travel? How gorgeous does Mitchell look in this picture? Oh, proud to be married to a man who fights for justice. Oh, Mitchell over his cold. Hope my hubby brings the love tonight. Ooh, my dad liked that. Well, how's the priest doing here? Oh, it's just a checkup. One of the baby's maybes possessed. Wait, are you baptizing them behind Haley and what's his name's back? You can't do that to other people's kids. It's not a big deal if it works. The babies are protected, their souls are safe, and they're gonna spend eternity in heaven. If it doesn't, it's just like I gave them a little bath. Hey, Kasky, come on, something more interesting going on over there? Yeah, does anybody else see the dolphin fighting the chicken? Because I got hit pretty hard in the head earlier. All right, let's go. Thought it'd be fun to fly a plane into my face? What kind of monster does that to another human being? Oh, no. Look at this. Did you go get Mrs. D? Oh, yeah, sure. I see if I can find her. I want her to regret breaking up with him. No, not that. Anything but improv. Improv is no different than getting waterboarded. Just stay calm, go to a pleasant place in your mind, and remember that you're not actually dying. Fine. I'll do it. Goodbye. Go back to sleep. Why'd you bring a crowbar? No reason. But the truth is, Claire, in this light, you're reminding me so much of your mother. Well, it's the hair. Same neck. Oh, you must be Jerry. I'm Dylan's mom, Farah. How wonderful to meet you. Full disclosure, I'm a hugger. I'm sorry. I'm not very comfortable with that, because I'm a kisser. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I'm responsible. I'm nurturing. I, okay, I'm nurturing too. When Lily was a baby, I sang her to sleep every night with perfect pitch. Ah. Well, I used to look at her through the window every morning when I'd drop her off at school until the security guard took my picture. You're welcome. They don't call me Filament Dumpty for nothing. That is cute. But you are still selling houses, right? Oh, shoot. I have a showing in 20 minutes. Oh! Love you. 
Hey, Dad, you're just gonna stand there while your wife calls me a tramp? I feel this is a risky time to weigh in. Agreed. No more fighting. Let's just all enjoy a cheese ball. It's my grandma's 100-year-old recipe, except I use cayenne pepper instead of cocaine. Word to the wise. I'm like the last five Matthew McConaughey movies. You never saw me. This is what we always do on the holidays. What's the big deal? The big deal is that this could be our last Christmas together. What? What? Last Christmas? What? 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 Oh, my God, you're dying? No, I'm not dying. It's something else. Uh. Is he pausing to be dramatic? What do you think? We it just... all started last fall. Have you heard anything about the job yet? No, no, not yet. But, and I may not for a couple months, but it's out of my control, and I'm just, I'm letting go. This is killing me! Our whole future hangs in the balance, and these people, they don't care. They don't care! I'm better now. Whatever happens, happens. Okay, give me my damn phone. I'm gonna call the sadist, and I'm gonna ask them why they hate me! I really do care about Sherry. I go to sleep thinking about her. I wake up thinking about her. When I see her, it's like my heart is smiling. Wow. I didn't think this house could get any gayer. Because I hold back. I have strong opinions that I don't tell you because I want to get along. Like what? You can tell me anything. Like that bus bench sign. I think it's goofy. If we have 2020 vision, why are we wearing glasses? Screw them. I love what we have. Mwah. Mwah. Hmm. I'm so blessed. It's like no matter. What I do, I'm always going to have a B-plus life. Never an A. And Happy New Year to you, too. <laughs> Behold, our famous candy wall. Hey, sugar babies. Yes, honey buns. Luckily, the Prescott has an 80s aerobicized class, which will be full of single older ladies. Women hit a sweet spot right after 40 where they still look great, but their standards have lowered. I just had to sneak back in and do it without her knowing. Ready to order? Very. I came to this restaurant for one thing and one thing only. And that thing is? Sorry, uh, one of your world fat. One of our world's fattest hot dogs. Coming no, up. The, the slider. And how would you like Me. it? Me. Yes, you, sir. But it goes too fast. Oh, no, don't worry. I shall vary the flex of my buttocks to control our speed. Uh, okay. It should be a... Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> my deepest apologies! <laughs> Maybe there were so many of them. So how old is this, Bex? 44. It's on. Oh, there you are. Wait, you're Bex? Yep. And I'm eager to learn. A warning, my form's clumsy, but I'm great with my feet. OK, who gets the dude? It's a warehouse full of dog beds that nobody wants to buy. It's been a slow period, but it should pick up next quarter. What? When all the dogs get back their income tax refund and they want to go splurge on beds for themselves? It took a little while, but I finally convinced Manny the reason he had failed last time with Brenda Feldman was because of his grand gesture. Today called for a completely different approach. A super grand gesture. Just go to her. Okay, get in there. Let's go. Come on. Yeah. You think it would be unethical to hire the second most qualified candidate? What's wrong with the most qualified? And after graduating Stanford Engineering, I was offered a Rhodes Scholarship. Do you have any questions for me? Oh, oh my ah. gosh. I'm, uh, can, can we help you? Name's Murray Clark. I grew up in this house. Oh, hi. Well, my name is Cameron. This is my husband, Mitchell. Well, that's funny. <laughs> Okay, uh, so we were just about to leave. Um, see, I get all my pants. I haven't for the... seen this house since I went off to war. Oh, and you'd like to come in and take a look around a little bit? No, nothing like that. I just came here to die. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. Get in here. No, I'm good. Well, if you're trying to look cool, just throw some splashy event and auction off the space trip to charity. That could work. What kind of charity? Walls are hot right now. I love that. 
I'm gonna save the wolves. We're saving them, right? Marvin, Milton. No, it's Murray. Murray. Oh. Murray. Murray. Oh my God, did he actually die? Calm down, I'm, I'm first aid certified. Murray. Murray! Who ah! taught you first aid, a nanny on death row? I come to! Well, it's not a trip to space. I hope that the Phil Dumphy Center for Wolves will be a fitting honor for the man who changed my life. We'll have a big opening ceremony. <laughs> You'll meet all the wolves. <laughs> now let's go do this again in front of the cameras. <laughs> I'm terrified of wolves. Uh, excuse me, um, do you say um, um, what are you looking for? Mona Lisa, McDonald's, both are that way. Fellow press agitator? Yes. <laughs> Put her there. <laughs> Your watch, sir. Looking for this? What? Oh. Bonjour. Oh, une table pour un, monsieur? Oh, yeah. Très bien. Vous me suivez? Ah. Oh. Oh. Ah. Merci. It was easy to fit in. All I had to do was look good and have a lot of attitude. Paris was just like one big gay bar. Gloria, we are so sorry, but we're not going to be able to make it to Joe's play. No, no, Ronaldo's mom, she had, well, she had emergency surgery, and uh, he and Pepper dropped off their Great Danes to our place with no warning. Roo, 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 roo. No, no, stay away from that, not the very... Sorry, Gloria, I got to go. But be careful. I know what I'm doing, honey. I've got this. Oh, oh, boy. oh boy. Oh, God. My leg is stuck. Somebody do something. I'm really good at getting rings off. Do you want me to butter your thighs? Open up. Get your hand away from oh, me. Open up. It's damn good. Why do I always default to no? It's Gloria, right? Should I try slim cut jeans? I'd love that. But first, I'd like to take some notes. Tilt up. It's what I love about this industry. Never a dull moment. It's not plugged in. The sanctimonious academic looking down on the star pupil because of her thousand dollar shoes. Those shoes were a thousand dollars? Damn it. Did they come with medicine for a village? Wait, wait, so you've been a cab driver, a hairdresser, a spokesmodel, and a mover. Is, is your life real? Is anything real? That was a question that I asked myself when I was a philosophy professor. Bacon? You're gonna smell that. Oh my god, I didn't think about that quick. Eat it! Oh, worth it! Oh, worth it! Uh, maybe kiss on the cheek? How provocative. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, oh, and one, two, three. Oh, oh god, oh. good god. I'm oh. so sorry. I, I'm, I got no, my, I thought my, you my meant hooks your, in your cheek. cheek. No. Cheek. Wow. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, I did that. We have it. Yeah. We have it. And then well super done, important. us. Oh, good god. Oh, this is great. No, this, this is my chance to be there for you. Are you sure? I, I don't care where we live, as long as you're there by my side. Always. Oh. All right, now let's celebrate with some champagne. Yeah. Mitchell, Mitchell, that was beautiful. Well, everyone was looking at me. What the f was I supposed to say? If this is a pretty good family, I would never forgive myself. No, no, we're stronger than that, okay? We're gonna be fine. Yeah. Not not now, Lily. You guys are gonna end up singing. Just get to it. Excuse me, young lady. We're, we're having a, a serious conversation here, okay? Do not reduce us to a couple stereotypical, my love. Oh, there's a tornado warning in Missouri. Uh, our flight's delayed two hours. So. Oh, oh, that's oh. Okay. Uh, okay. 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 okay, yeah. You guys remembered my birthday! <laughs> Surprise! Surprise! It's nice we had this extra time together thanks to that lucky tornado. It hit an elementary school, Phil. Thanks again for putting in a good word for us with the owner. Yeah, he just needed some reassurance, considering most of Dylan's money is tied up in Dave and Buster's gift cards. Mm -hmm. Safer than banks. I'm finished here. Hey, don't you talk like that. Could I please have a spoon? Whatever you need, buddy. Uh, Whoa, what, what the hell are you doing? We'll stay close. How come you never wrote a poem for me? Don't you get it? They were all for you. <laughs> okay, um, I'm gonna set an example and be the first one to let go. <laughs> that 
Hoezo? Wat vond ik? 